Today's program is very, very important to listen to. You have to, even though if you have not been sharing our program before, today is very, very compulsory. Today, the Daleni, Lati Shai, Lati Pawin, Yawale, Dorintia Magbeyawo, until you claim me at Yawani, until you come to Yawani. As the real one, yawa ti moba do justice. Insha Allah. Insha Allah. Ki yalom ba shima pele pele. Ati ni yawa ti ya toro toro daru kwa. Yawa yawa yawa. Yawa shadiyat. Abla Aziz unike. Ki yolom ba mi dupe fwa fwa Kolom ba shikada fwa Ola kou Kora ni la azim Kou ti mwa fè kolom ba shi fwa Kolom wola an baba Ti mwa ba fwa An mouri shi bwa Mola na wa ulu wa ya rwa A shik Al imam al mubajal al kari Al kari Asyik Marfudin Unike Adam Allah wa ayatau wa daulatau Kolom ba Dupe fuma La wudu olong Ola anu olong La la khawla wa la kuwata Ola billah la alih la azim Bakana Anki ya wa Udu ni wa fuma Wa kinsya ma fungu luku Ya wa rashida Ati wushola Ti Lati Canada long Ti nou wandun la wala wabay Olo mabba yinu jew Olo wala wala Lata li yina gori Ti branch mwen yel shese shi Olo mabba yinu jew Olo wala wala Olo anu wala E a shi yire ti yawa Raja wakawla Ti olo mba Bay wanda fun waki Mba wale Insha Allah E ni Ka ebi mwen so if you have not been sharing our program, today's program is very, very important to listen to. Call your friends and family to come and listen to the topic, home, the home, its challenges, consequences, and possible solutions to identify issues. Oshe pata kilewa Kini ya wang kudye kudye tiyan li ni nule. Kini ya wang ti yon fa. Kudye kudye yon na. Kini. Solution ta le mou asi. Ti le wofi doun. Ti yon ni anene. Tori kbe. Ile o lewa. Koma si kudye kudye embe. Kudye kudye tu ba wang nule na. Ba wo ni. Ashe takwe. Ba o ni ashe ni dili alayo. Ba o ni le wa yo she dun ti o lanyoni. Ba o ni le te mi ati te yo she dun ti o lanyoni. Ati le ton she ki lo ba ina ni sin yina. Ba o ni o she ri. Ile ina ni agbo ju o insha Allah le ni. 
ki olom ki olom ba shi alhamdulillah rabbil alamin inna alhamdulillah nahbudu wa nasta'inu wa nastaghfiru wa na'udhu billahi min shururi anfusina wa min sayyi'ati a'malina ma yadallahu fala mudilla la wa ma yudni fala adiya la wa nashhadu allah ilaha illallah wa adaw la sharika la wa anna muhammadan abdu wa rasuluhu arsala rasulahu bil uda wa din al aq li yusiru wa la din kulli wa kafa billahi shahida alhamdulillah la kulli hali alhamdulillah ibada kulli hali alhamdulillah qabla kulli hali alhamdulillah rabbil alamin raditu billahi rabba wa bil islam dina wa bi muhammadin nabiyya wa rasulillah wa bil qurhani imaman wa dalilan all thanks and praise is due to almighty allah the omnipotent the merciful the lord of the day of yawm al-qiyamah the lord of the day of accountability is allah today tomorrow every day is allah we thank allah we thank allah we glorify allah we adore him we seek refuge in allah from the evil within ourselves and the consequences of our evil deeds whoever allah guides we never be led astray and whoever allah led astray we never find guidance i bear witness that there is no god but almighty allah alone no partner and i bear witness that muhammad rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam is the servant and apostle of almighty allah adupe fun olohun aseyin fun olohun gugu ope ti olohun oba ni oba okan soso ni oba ti o ni ni waju oba ti o ni leyin oba ti o ni ni laarin oba ti o lafi oba ti o lafijo oba to je pe gugu ogba lo fi se aye anu wa gugu ogba lo fi sa furiji fun wa gugu ogba lo fi da wa lohun adupe fun olohun oba na asi wa ike ige lo si odo anabi wa muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam nitori pe en ti olohun ba fi mana ku se ni ti o tun le si lona ma en ti olohun o ba si fona ma pe gugu wa pa pe jo pe ka fona ma o nto won na o ni mana e a wa toro abo ku lodo shaitan eni eko eni egbe eni gbeji si ike olohun tolohun ti fi laana ekan Allah ma ju raye lodo wa leni ola ogu olohun ola anu olohun ike olohun abu olohun to tin be lori wa latana to tin be lori wa lateni yo ma be lori wa gbere eh eni nti a ma gbojuwo ni ile eh ohms the ohm uh its challenges consequences and possible solutions to identify issues insha allah eh ama lo si ama direct questions lo so do awon ya wa insha allah ti won de ma ba wa se justice si sugbon ile ti o dumo mi nu ka to lo sori eto gangan ni pe eni ti o ba ti se a program wa ri tetele eh ile yi di sadaqa to jaria lati se a e lati pa won eyan wole lati wa gbo nitori to kan mi in to kan ina ni to kan gbo wa ki olohun jo ile wa to tin dun olohun ma bale wa je o olohun ma bale wa je won ni tidu kan ba nturo tile kan ba nturo o ma le be ni ti dagba olohun ma ja ni o ma le nle ma je o ma le lu ile ti wa dagba olohun jo ma yongisi tori ko ma bale je eh ko olohun wala si wa je da na bi wa muhammad gba won ya wa tun ma ba soro lori eto eh olohun to tin fun yin so lana eh tun fun yin so le ni ai ni fun yin so mo olohun ma fi se ti olohun gu olohun ولا نول ولا قوة ولا أكبر ولا خول ولا قوة إلا بالله العلي العظيم إن أني أدريتو الإمام إيسا آيات الله محمد الخاول لا كوكو مو مالوسي ودوام يا وا تمو في توت ودارو كو يا وا شديات أبلا عزيز أونيك إنك بابا كلا كني ليجا كلا لي كني لي أمم ودو يا واني أوكو كلو Mm, odo ya wa shadia unike e ba gboju won kan ka le pe ni ile ki la le pe ni ile bismillah auzu billahi minash shaitanir rajim 
Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alamin. Wa salatu wa salam ala Rasulillah. Adukwe fun olon. Olon wa batu gajulon. Olon wa batu da ugwaye. To si da bubo to wa ninwe. Ona lo da sama. Ona lo bata njike. Ona lo bata njike si. Awa be olon ba koba wa sheikhi atike fun wa nabi wa Muhammad. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Ugwa wan to un teli a ti. Ugwa ya wa te biti ti ti yo jok bwe nge. Oni ki nan kwe ni ili. Taba wo oro tonje ili. O koja. Inta li so kwe bo ya ibu bwe la sa. Inta an kwe ni ili ni nou islam. Ito je kwe. Moni o koja ibu bwe la sa. O je ibu bwe to je kwe. I fè gbodo wà ni bè. A la fi a gbodo wà ni bè. I fò kamba lè. O gbodo wà ni bè. Ta ba wò i gba tò lò ngbe. Tò lò ngbe fi fè o kwa ta ya. Di lè. O ni tò li ki i fè lè ba wà la a rin wà. Kò lè gbe pò ni nò a la fi a. Kwe fò fò tranquility. Fò lò. So, o mi kwe gbo gbo i bu gbe pa ta. Ti o ba si tranquility. Ti o si mercy. Ti o si lò. A le kwe, ilè la san la san kaniye. Kwe a kwe ni, ti o yibo ma kwe ni house, not a home. So if you're talking about a home, we are referring to a place where there is love, there is tranquility, there is everything that one will want to go back to. That whenever you go out, you want to come back to such a place. That is home. If you come back, you want to come back to such a place. If you talk about the war, you talk about the war. If you talk about the war, you talk about the war. If you talk about the war, you talk about the war. If you talk about the war, you talk about the war. 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 Ati yon mwa atakwa ati yawo. Kwa jek pe ki islam wo joba ni rou le nan. Ki fo kambale wame ki bo bwe po tutu. Kwa ni fo kambale. Kwa ni alafia. Inton jay ili ni yen. Alhamdulillah. Ili ni wanti ba waswa. Ili ti yon ni fo kambale. Jek pe ti yon ba lo. Fo kambale atu wambe. Adupe lo do anwa yawo. Antou rin ti afe goju wo upo gan. Le ni. Eh, atu nga si odo iya wa ake wu shola. Ile la ti gbo yen. Ipe, how do we understand home? Anti ba sala ye. Eh, mwa weka ba ake yinan ba bo juo. How do we sustain that home? Anti si definition yifun wa. But how do we sustain the home? Iya wa ake wu shola. Eh, ti mi u tara yon. Now, Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen, wa salatu wa salam, ala ashraf ule anbiyai, wa imamu limu usali. Subhanaka la ili molano, ila mo alamtano, inoka anta alimu alakim. All glory, all honor, all adorations are due to the Most High, the one and only, the Lord of the Lords, the God of the Lords. Um... And may the peace of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala continue to be on our holy prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Um, I thank my mommy in the house for that beautiful um, definition and explanation of a home. That was indeed a perfect home that she has just explained to us right there. So when we now have a perfect home, how do we sustain this? How do we hold this home? What can we do that this home home is not going to turn to shambles. What can we do to be the solid rock of this home? So the first and foremost thing to do is to build the foundation of a home on our prayer. That is, we let Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be the foundation of the home. So we turn to him for everything that we want to do in the home. Um, we call him day in, day out. 
we we plan and we let um, him take the decision of whatever we're going to do. We talk to him. We ask him for what we want. It is our home, like our mommy rightly said. So we want to sustain it. We want it to look better out there. We don't want it to, to collapse. So we have to build a home on, on the efficacy of prayer. As it is said, that prayer is the key and prayer is the sword of a Muslim and Muslima. So may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala uphold our home. When it is good, you need prayer. When it's bad, you need prayer. When it, the, the, there are challenges, there are difficulties, you need prayers. So if you are the one that prays a lot, then you'll be able to sustain your home. If anything is coming, you know how to handle it and you know how to tackle it. That is the number one thing that we must have in a home. The another thing is endurance. Endurance is, uh, you know, there are lots of difficulties in a home. There are lots of ups and downs. There are lots of challenges. So how do we uh, conquer these challenges? How do we sustain? How do we thrive in the challenges? So we need to be able to endure. We need to be able to face those challenges uh, squarely. We don't have to run away. So you should face your challenges. You don't run away from your challenges. If you, if you run away from it today, is you know, you're still coming back to it tomorrow. So the best thing is for you to, you know, uh, stay there, face it and, and deal with it. With the grace of Allah, you'll be able to uh, to manipulate and to, to, to come out successfully. So another thing is um, after endurance, you need to persevere. So you face the, the difficulties, but you continue to strive. You continue to be steadfast. You want to make the best out of it. So it's not enough for you to run away. So face the challenges uh, squarely, deal with it, and then come out triumphantly by the will of Allah and by the grace of Allah. Subhanahu wa ta'ala, you'll be able to uphold and you'll be able to sustain your home. Another thing is uh, commitment. Commitment is huge. Commitment is more than feelings. It goes hand in hand with uh, what we call love. When you are committed, you are selfless. You are not self-centered. You are there to serve everyone. The husband is there to serve the woman and the children. Ditto to the woman is there to serve the husband, the wife, and everybody around the home. To make it a living place. To make it a home, not a house. So when you are committed, you are doing your own quota, you know, uh, to making things work in the in the home, then you are not seeing yourself as doing a favor to anyone. You are seeing yourself as, you know, discharging your own duty in maintaining and sustaining the home. Uh, so after that, we need maturity. So a home supposed to kind of build over time, you know, to maturity needs to build over time in a home. I mentioned this some times ago, that uh, the reason why men are called the the bridegroom on their wedding day and the wives are called the the bride because the men still need to tame still need to train the wife and then so both of them need to mature together there are some things that will be happening that love alone or feelings alone will not be able to you know uh, to make ends meet with that. So you need that commitment. When you are committed, you, you are acting as if your whole life, everything about you depends on that home and depends on that marriage. So you want at all costs, you want it to, to work. And I make Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala assist us in doing this and uh, handling, handling this. So self-control is another thing. So in a relationship, we need self-control. If we're not able to control ourselves, then we'll find ourselves doing what is not, you know, um, falling prey of things, trivial things that are not supposed to even, you know, come near us or come near our home. So if you're able to apply self-control, then you know what you want and you are steadfast at getting those things. And then you are not comparing your home with any other person's home. You are contented with whatever you have. You love your husband. You love your children. You love your home the way it is. No matter how it is, even if it's a one-room apartment, it is your home. 
even if it's a mansion, it is your home. You are self-contented. You are not looking at other people. You are not, you know, um, competing with anyone. So contentment and self-control is very, very important in maintaining a home. Another thing is communication. Communication. We can emphasize um, the issue of communication enough in a home. For us to sustain a home, we need to communicate. We don't have to bottle off things. We don't have to keep malice. We don't have to keep grudges. We need to be able to bring everything on the table. We sit at the table, we iron things out, we plan, and then we we'll look for the way forward. If we cannot communicate among each other, then uh, our problems lies, which we may not be able to handle. If care is not taken, um, this will lead to emotional distress. And emotional distress will lead to uh, mental health issues and so many other, other things can res result from uh, you know you bottling up things, not speaking out or not speaking up. So Ejekasoros, okay, in, in our home so that we can you know uh, deal with our issues amicably. Um, then another thing is reliability. Reliability, even not, not, not within a home alone, wherever you are, you should be able to be reliable. People, people must be able to rely on you. You must be able to keep to your words. You must be able to keep to your promises. When you mention something or when you tell somebody that you're going to do something, you should be able to do it. But if you are not able to do it or you're not able to complete the task, you should be able to go back to the person, state the reason why you're not able to do it. You don't just leave it the way it is. If you leave it the way it is, when you mention something or you say something next time, they're not going to rely on you. They will say, mm, she won't do it. So in our home, we need to be able to be reliable so that our husband and our children can trust us. So the children will say, if mommy said this, she's going to stand by it. And your children too will emulate that and they will follow suit. So you will have a strong home you'll be able to uphold your, your home. So I will, I will pause there for now. Abonyo Imam. Alhamdulillah, uh, we are able to understand uh, the own uh, the way it's supposed to be, the way we're supposed to be with our home, push your kill it while she really at the understand there. I had a just understand the way Kila if you sustain in Lewa to live it through that. Also, my also do I want your unique insha Allah. If we please, ma, can you help us itemize some challenges uh, in the home and provide uh, possible solution to them? The challenges and the solution, inshallah. Alhamdulillah, 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 Hirabili Alamin. Um, we've heard from our sister um, how you can sustain a home. Now, basically, if you're looking at the challenges that you can find in a home, the challenges we emanate from you not being able to sustain your home. You not being able to take to and do those tasks that she mentioned. Now, generally, what are those challenges that we find in homes? What are the causes of these challenges? Number one, if you look at the economy of today, with this COVID, with this uh, problem of lockdown, the pandemic, and so many other issues. All these things have affected the home a lot. Number one thing that I want to talk about is poverty. Poverty. It is encompasses so many problems. Economic hardship within the society. When the breadwinner of the home is not able to fulfill the financial aspect of the home. Mm. There is always a problem. Oh, well. Talk about providing money for school fees, providing money for the upkeep of the home. 
if the breadwinner of the home runs into problem fulfilling this means, then such a home will have problems. You find some women who can endure so much, who endure, but there is a limit. Even the children over time will not expect the father again. When they come home all the time, daddy will need this, daddy will need that, and is not able to provide it. So economic hardship, poverty, these are key things. Because for a home to be sustained, the financial aspect is very, very strong. Financially, everything must be stable for that home not to have challenges. Then another problem also is the problem of infidelity. Infidelity among the couples. If there is infidelity, whether from the husband's side or the woman's side, all this will result in a shake-up of that home. Because that would be something that has to do with betrayal of trust. Whether the infidelity is coming from the woman or from the man. Where the man will not be able to trust the woman or the woman is not able to trust the man. Because for a home to be highly sustained, trust is very, very important. Both have to trust themselves. So when infidelity comes in, what do you see? This trust is destabilized. And when this trust is destabilized, the home is destabilized. That peace we talked about, that tranquility we talked about, we go out through the window and that home will be destabilized. Another problem, another challenge is that the home can face is the issue of incompatibility between couples. If the couples are incompatible, you see some, some, add some traits. You find some traits that cannot go together. If the husband is a blow hot type, or a quick temper type, and the wife is same, then the endurance, the patience, the tolerance that Elijah Akil Shalak talked about will not be there. While the husband is blowing hot, the woman too is blowing hot. Then it's like a volcano. Mm. Is there peace? Is there tranquility? No. So this will bring about challenges that the home, the peace in the home will be destabilized. Mm. So they will not be able to tolerate themselves. They will not be able to endure themselves. So if it's a situation where there is compatibility, then when one is hot, the other one is cool. So other problems, like she mentioned earlier, that communication is key in sustaining a home. When there is lack of communication in the home, whether it is from the children to the parents, the parents to the children, between the couples, if there is lack of communication, if there is no nice arrangement, that will allow the woman to speak up when she has issues in her mind, to allow the man to speak up when he has issues in his mind, or to even allow children to speak up, air out their opinion, contribute. They say nothing about us without us. If you want to take a decision about the children, the children too must take part in it. That is when it can be sustainable. So lack of communication is a, one of the big things that can cause challenges, that can cause problems in any home. There must be a synergy. There must be a kind of bond between the people in the home. Because if you bottle up, bottle up, bottle up, one day you will explode. And that piece in that house will all go. And also, we also have the problem of ego. If it's a home where the man has a lot of ego, there will be challenges. Then he will not be able to you know, accept the wife. He will not be able to respect the wife. It will always be me, me, me. And when it is just me, 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 of course, there will be trouble. Even No matter how much she can endure, no matter how much she can endure, 
there will always be issues. So ego on the part of the man. For instance, if you look at African men, this thing is like inbuilt. So men generally have that ego, and if the woman can, the woman's endurance level cannot match up with it, there will always be problems. So you also have the issue of uh, childlessness. We have seen so many homes with love, with tranquility, but we attach a lot to having children in any family. So where there is a delay, or the, child, the children don't come as early as possible, this can cause tension in the home. This can cause a lot of problems, challenges in the home. Whether it is the woman's side that the issue is coming up from, or the man's side, this is always a big issue, which creates a lot of challenges within the home. Lack of understanding. The couples not understanding themselves also brings a lot concerning challenges in any home. So you find all these creating problems, causing disability in the home. The sustainability of a home with these challenges becomes very, very problematic. Now, how do we solve this problem? We have talked about poverty. We have talked about economic hardship. We have talked about childlessness. The another thing I forgot to mention is the interference from in-laws. Mm. Interference from in-laws. If you have a lot of outsiders, third parties, prying into what goes on in the home, there will always be problems. Most times I say, if the man is not a good administrator, so differentiate between the love for his family and the love for the wife. Both have their place. Both should have their place in his heart. One must not affect the other. When it comes to your parents, your family, your siblings, your brothers, sisters, they have their own place. They have their own respect. When it comes to your wife, your children, they have their own place. They have their own respect. So where this, even if it's from also the part of the woman too, if you cannot differentiate your home, your husband, from the love you have for your mother, your brother, your fathers, and the rest, there will always be clashes. So the solutions to all this is that we have seen that the reality of today is that we always say, don't put all your eggs in one basket. Diversify your means of livelihood, your means of economic um, income. Do not put all your eggs in one basket. We have seen that people who have different ways through which they make money. If you are working, ensure there's something by the side you are doing. Mm. If something happens to one, we pray it doesn't happen to both at the same time. So if you have different sources where you get money to sustain your home, then the issue of economic hardship, the issue of job loss, the issue of poverty can be alleviated to some extent. Then also, Men with issue of my wife should not work. My wife should be 100% at home. Yes, she can be at home. But there are so many things your wife can also do, even being at home, if you don't want her to work outside. There are so many online businesses she can do. All these will help in sustaining the home. So it shouldn't be an issue of poverty, economic hardship, job loss, affecting the home's adversely mm. then another problem is uh, another solution to some of the problems highlighted is that there has to be tolerance understanding between couples when you are marrying you need to look at the person you want to marry mm. is this the person i want my children to be like mm. is this i uh, do i want my son to be like this man do i want my daughter to be like this woman then if your answer is yes go ahead because the foundation matters. Who did you marry? Why did you marry that person? All these things go a long way to ensure stability in the home, to ensure a home has less friction. If you base your home 
if it is on if you base it with the foundation of Allah, you know, we always say it's Tiara, it's Tiara. If you use Allah, base it on that foundation, and with the fear of Allah, if you marry somebody who has the fear of Allah in himself or herself, then whatever challenges that come up, you'll be able to, you know, give just leave everything to Allah that life is not a bed of roses, that you have ups and downs in life. And all these things we need to sustain. We need to stand by each other. We need to stand by Allah. If you marry a God-fearing person, that person will be fair to you. That mm. person will not go into all these problems of infidelity we are talking about. We will be able to tolerate ourselves. We will be able to rely on Allah whenever there are problems. We, we won't have to resort into destabilizing the peace in the home. The, 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 the ability to keep the home, to say to each other, we are in this for life, will be sustained. That you need to tell yourself, we are in this for life. That there won't be challenges is impossible. But we will be ready to sit down and face these challenges, talk about it. And you know, when issues come, the issue of communication, you'll be able to sit him down. You'll be able to look for the moment where he will listen to you. You will know when best to talk to him, not when he is hot or when she is hot. You know the best time to talk to each other and make amicable solutions to the pro to, to whatever challenges that you are facing. So with God's consciousness, you know challenges will definitely come. And Allah has said it that he's going to try us in so many ways. That mere saying you believe is not the solution. But when these issues come and you are able to stand by him, then you'll be able to. Then when you have issues of childlessness, Instead of sitting there and thinking, oh, somebody somewhere is doing, or maybe she has been into this or that. Apart from praying, relying on Allah, please do medical checkup. There are so many things that can be done medically, and you also add a spiritual aspect. Family should pray together. A family that prays together stays together. There's no way you have challenges if you pray together. Even the men should go to the masjid, but you have other nafila prayers that can be said at home. Now you people can sit together, pray together. With these, whatever challenges that come can be surmounted. Thank you so much. I think I would pause there too. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. Because when we look at diaspora, we especially in america canada uk germany everywhere uh we can see uh why and i want you to explain briefly reasons why marriage is why marriage is relegated the marriage is relegated and divorce is widely celebrated in the present days why why that briefly inshallah Assalamualaikum. Alaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Subhanallah. Um, this is a very um, dicey situation, and it's a very critical issue these days. Um, so first and foremost, I will say that in the past, in the olden days, our four parents, they built their marriage, they built their home on trust, on humility, on respect. And the women, most especially, were submissive to their husband. So irrespective of what they are going through, they hold on to that home. They know it's their home. They don't want to let it go. Even in the heat of the challenges, they persevere, they endure, they are steadfast. Unfortunately, 
nowadays, it's hard to see somebody that will persevere in the heat of challenges. We have very few people, but very few, not a lot of people. Um, ki olong kushanua, kubawa so bube, kubawa so di irora. So, number one thing is impatience on the part of the both both parties, women and men. So, we don't have patience these days. So, everything is like a go, 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 go kind of a situation. So, we want everything on a platter of gold. We don't want to suffer. We, we were thinking that you, Rome was built in a day, and this is not possible. There is no way that there will be no challenges here and there. Anywhere, in every facet of life, we should realize that there will be challenges. But when there are challenges, we need to be able to exercise some patience. Because let, let's say, for example, if you are going into a business, the first year, second year, third year, you may not, not, not make so uh, much profit from the business. But when you are able to persevere, when you're able to endure, then gradually you'll be building your customers and then your profits will be coming in gradually. So if we are in a little to we be in a relationship, so we should know that the relationship that we are in, the world itself is not a bed of forces. And then we should realize that behind every dark cloud, there will be silver lining. So we should be able to stay and have patience. So when there are challenges, when things turn sour, maybe a husband lost a job or the wife lost his job or something, something terrible happened. So we should realize that it's not going to be the end of the world. And then we should be praying to Allah that, you know, we should not submerge into the, into the challenges or into the difficulties, that we should come out triumphantly. So if we, if we run out, we throw everything out of the door. Then another person, when the waves of the moment finally re re relaxes, another person is coming in to enjoy whatever you have labored for. So we should try to be patient with whatever situation that we find ourselves in and have it at the back of our mind that it's not going to last. That is a trying period. It's the wave of the moment. It's going to pass at some point in time. So we need patience. That patience is lacking. That is why uh, divorce is at the forefront today. One of the reasons why divorce is at the forefront today and the marriage is thrown out of the out of the door, and it has not been uh, as such in the past. So we should try to emulate our four parents, you know, saying in their marriage, and at the end of the day, they're enjoying the fruits of their labor. When you play in your in your in your legere oko kujere omo, so I want ya ni mo fiara dauri shiri shini ba ni, so ibenye. Pata pata won jerry won momo and then I won't call you know one one bath later on. So we should try to emulate that. Tabati ni suru to po uh ni masari kakiri, iliwa u deni ni daru, ka believe we unkoto bono oshimboa oshimboa dero wedu a baro long at the adura. Then irresponsibility, uh most especially on the past part of men of nowadays. Men of nowadays, they are not ready to take off their responsibilities. They are, they, some of them are leaving the responsibilities to the woman, especially if the woman is okay. Uh, so no matter how you should treat, you should still try to do your best. No matter how little it is, you know, let your wife know that you are the husband and some responsibilities are yours. So you should not shy away from it. You should stand up to your responsibilities. And it is, uh, I believe, from where we came from, that uh, responsibility of Corini, I'm not going to help. So it's his responsibility to pay the bills. It's his responsibility to do this or do that. And then even though you have the money, some men are not ready to part with their money. They still want the husband to do this. So it, it's all, all affects our bearing on. We should be a brother's keeper. We should be able to learn um, enhance when the husband needs it. So in the olden days, even when the when the women are two, three, four in a man's house, you will, you can hardly tell where 
omo eleyi lele abi pe okunrin o lowo lowo some women will take up the responsibility ensure that the, the the children have good education that the children are not lacking in anything to the best of her abilities and we even do same to the children of his co-wives too but in the recent past i i, I don't know uh men are not responsible women are not responsible that is why divorce is is a thing of the of the of the moment so they don't care and the the stigma attached to it is is nowhere to be found in the past when you are when you are single wamarunupe wamamafujupe wansopo wadale moshu ehe but these days you'll be hearing my ex that my first ex my second ex so it's it's, it's like a derivative of the moment i'm on your feet to do some more so and then another thing is negligence so negligence i would say most especially anyway it's both ways um the, if the man cannot prioritize um a schedule or prioritize its needs there will be there will be some issues in the home so if you think that it's all about you or all about your work or all about your job some women out there they don't care about the money they don't care about material things but they want attention they want you to be home they want you to be there so they want to feel loved they want they want to feel uh wanted so in a situation where you think your work is taking the most part of your day and then you are not establishing this, this part with your family. Um, there are bound to be um, surprises. There are bound to be to be divorce or, or separation or infidelity, as my mommy rightly said. If the woman is not getting it from you, she, she will want to go outside. You know, whatever it can, she cannot find from you, she believes that she can get it from elsewhere. And then about the career women too so the career women are negligent so they don't take care they don't take appropriate care of their homes so where we came from we have all this domestic stuff that we you know you can have your drivers you have your house help you have this you have that some people they will go to the extent that it's the house house help that is preparing their husband's meal that is you know Taking care of the children, taking care of the husband. Oh, yeah, Kira, when you have a way, I want to not see a real relation. Because when you are supposed to be there for your husband and you are not there and your house self is there, you know, anything can happen. And when anything happens, you you found out, then you're thinking that you can't take this. This is a slap on your face, and the next thing is for you to seek divorce, not thinking that you cause the problem for you neglecting your home. So irrespective of our careers, irrespective of whatever we we want to be in life, the moment we say we say yes, and the moment we we take the marital vows, we should know that uh, everything about us has to you know be planned around our our home to have uh, a successful home and to be able to sustain uh, our homes. Another thing is in e equality. So the white women believe that uh, being submissive to the men is a thing of the past. It's like that is an, an archaic um, situation that and now we the rub shoulders you know with the with the men uh, forgetting the fact that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentioned in the holy quran i think it's quran 4 verse 34 that he has made men you know the head and the, the sustainer and the maintainer of uh, of women because he has given them more strength to be able to manage the women and that the women are supposed to be submissive, like a devout or righteous woman, are supposed to be submissive uh, to their husband and guard whatever Allah has, you know, put in their possession to guard whether their husband is around or not. So we should try and not rub shoulders with her husband. So with the the position, especially in this part of the of the world, uh, it. it it is it's found out that the the women are in higher positions or 
earning higher than the husband, you know, like about, I would say about 75% of women, if I'm not mistaken, are in good position and making more money than the husband. So, and this woman, most of them will now be rubbing it on the husband face, you know, forgetting the fact that if the man does not allow you to take that education or allow you to do the job, you may be, you may not be able to be where you are today. And then we should know that life is not a bed of roses and no, no position is permanent. So you are okay today. You never can tell. The table can turn tomorrow and the man can be okay tomorrow, you know? So what will you do? So whatever we have, we should know that, you know, it's Allah that give it. It's not by our own making. It's not by our own might. It's not by our own power. It's just by the will of God that we are fortunate to be to be where we are. So we should try to be submissive. We are not slave. We are not um, a second fiddle person. But it's just that we should give respect to whom it is due. Those are the things that are lacking that are causing divorce to be more um, celebrated today and marriage is, you know, relegated. Um, so peer influence, again, I watched a movie some time ago that the lady is always complaining, you know, seeing her friend's husband, you know, lavishing exotic materials, exotic gifts on the wife without knowing that, you know, this man is physically abusing the wife at home. So the wife is not only going through physical abuse, she was at the same time going through emotional abuse, you know, and then having a lower self-esteem. But people are seeing outsider, you know, she's driving the best car, they are going on vacation, they are doing this, they are doing that, and the, the other friends, you know, are blaming their husband for not buying such gifts to them, for not taking them out and stuff like that, until the bubble busted. I, I don't know, maybe eventually something happened, he eventually killed the lady or something happened, I can't really remember. Then the, the the other lady now started, you know, appreciating her husband, you know, apologizing and stuff like that. So we shouldn't let peer influence, you know, ruin our homes. We should learn to be contented. We should learn to love what we have. We should know that, you know, if 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 I'm in a in a one room apartment, like I rightly said the other time, it's my home. I am okay with it. And then another thing is that when you know that, you know. Life is, is difficult, you know, you cannot afford to put your children in a maybe private school. Why not, you know, try public school, whatever you can do to make life easy for you. Why not go ahead and do it? These are the things that, you know, these days we are not taking cognizance of that is leading to divorce or separation. And, and then uh, this part of the world, people think that, you know, the government is going to take care of them going to give them houses, going to, you know, care for their children. Unfortunately, they don't realize that, you know, this thing will not take them anywhere. And it's not nothing compared to what both of you can achieve when you are together. Um, so for now, I will, I will pause there. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. Adukaloa wa yawa ki olomba shi alikum funyi. Allah ugu alam. Shubham fed dawa pada sayi diye a little bit. Ah, mudivelo sodo ya o nike insha Allah. Si aba wo ngati ya wa akiu shalan shalekan. Wani taba gudwe nyan baba wa. Taba fe ya wo. Taba konle. Eh, di mama ya li ya ma ya wo. Awana nja wo. Shubham kizipi mwa nja wo. Shubham taba wo agyota wa le ni. Eh, Papa, that I did ask for at our uncle boy. I repeat, I foresee you now, Paul. If I gave me, I won't be enough to get me on local. No, Paul, about statistics, who won't let me see. Tabawa woo, or for one play more, who be me, Lori, I be a won't break. I won't she back on. She told all the cab blame money. I be kidney solution got to the cash, she said, to one lay. Tori a wo lori esi, wo ba wo lori esi para para tori e kan buju wo, tori kwa tomo to ba ti de sa ten e jikan, wo ye kumari. Wa si wa ardi mwa to po ti e ruwa po ni si, wo ti e jikan mari, a ten tu de wijo, 
ati en tun je divorce e divorce ti won wa po nle bayi ai ti won de ngo yin le lo mi na pe ah eni bayi mo fe fe sugbe na fe na ti mari kidney solution si oro beyan kire de ba wa so seria beyan so bi la ma blame ni lori wi pe ah breaking homes so bi la fe blame ni abi bola fe prevent e abi se idi kan tun wa nbe to fi ri bayi ni abi ai te loro olohun Alhamdulillah. <laughs> The two parties have their different rules. Mm. Traditionally, you look at the man's role as the financial provider for the home. Now, even Allah Subhanahu wa Taala mentioned it too in the verse um, uh, our Hajia quoted, Surah to Nisa, verse thirty-four. The Arijalu Kawamuna Allah Nisa that the man is the provider. But people have, you know, interpreted different ways that this means maybe power, but actually what that means is he's a financial provider. Allah has made him a stronger person, not in terms of power now, but in terms of the father's pay, he has been given more provision to cater for the family, to take care of the family financially and the rest of it. Then what is the role of the woman? The woman is seen as the cornerstone of the home, the sustainer of the home. Traditionally, if you look at our mothers, like Ejo, ni tele, aripa won yawa, awon baba lo mama se wa la, awon yawa na awon na nsoko wo. To je pa awon na mo wale, bo to ba wo pe ta gan lo sustain ile ta gan lo ba indile to mu gbogbo e ko wa papo. Ni ti tele wa awon obirin ni pe ko si bi won se ni ah oko oko wa ya ko si boko se ya were to pe bo ti obirin ba e ba je okomule ro gidi obirin lo ma joko ko ma make sure pe gbogbo awon omo won wa papo gbogbo to nje idile won di mu papo so ta ba wo from that point of view ani oke o gbogbo divorce to po loni awon obirin na se suru awon obirin na se that women are no longer playing their roles. Rather than be at home, be there to sustain the home, to ensure the home is together, the children are well taken care of, the man's need well taken care of, that the women are now outside competing with the men. Outside competing with the men in different ways. The man's need well taken care of. And the main primary assignment we have relegated to the background. So on that note, you can say, okay, women are to be blamed. But in another way, in sustaining the home, which was what we started with, the roles are mutual. Both the husband and the wife need to work together. I mentioned it, that when people get married, they should say, we are in this together for life. Not I am in this together for life. No, it won't work. It must be both of you saying, we are in this together for life. So it means both of you will work together to ensure the stability, the sustainability of that home. So I said, okay, I said, I said, I atoko ati yawo na na ni ise lati se to ba ye ko birin le da se ni e ma ri pe pupo igba ti broken homes awon mo unstable te ba ra mo mi ton hu wa ki wa e lo wo won iya ati baba won won pe pa to ba ye pe iya le da se ni ko ni ri be abi pe nikan le da se so it means ka wa mejeji la godo jo sise papo ati ya ati baba pe ka jo fowo soya pe to ajo ma jo se ni oko to nfo ka kiri 
in the name of pe ohun sise lati kowo wale ti o joko lati make sure pe family bonding wa aye yen na ma si sile wahala lo ma si sile so ti ya wo nikan na ba wa le na nkan to ba lo n da se o ma pada ti pe wahala si ma wole na ni so there is need for the man to to also ensure pe the family thing won ni be yan ba lo 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 gbogbo awon ise ta la le kakiri yi ti se ba tan ibo la ma pada ti ile ni o so to ba ye pe leyen a ba ti se leyen ni ile alaafia ni ile ifokan bale gbogbo a di baru baru ba 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 n bari e na obirin na lo si ni a lot of ise lati se awon to n blame obirin won ri wi ta ba wo eyin wa pe bawo la won iya wa se se a opolopo nkan na farada opolopo nkan na farada opolopo baba mi lo lo to je ko tu pada wale opolopo baba mi lo fi awon iya yen sile to gba awon iyawo kaakiri lo se pe iya le na lo si tu pada wa ba iya le se suru na ni iya le la farada sugbon le ni awon obirin a fe la farada mo ati wo pe gbogbo e gbodo je ogba ogba pe boko mi se se bai kemi na se bai bo ba njupa bai kemi no ojupa bai gbogbo wa la ni rose wa lati play won wo gan won ni obirin to je po se n bi mo ko ye ko gba ise to ma ma gbe kuro ni leju ko gba awon ise to je pe o ma je ko ni aye ati ri aye to awon omo to ri baba wo gbogbo awon omo ta la nko leni na ton lo le oko ta ba ko won leko to da ti ya o sile ti ya o ri won ko ki no fe da ni le oko na eni ya ni broken homes po divorce po awon omo ikakaka ko won ni gbogbo ewa ton ma fi gbe le oko ton ma fi mo pe ile obi ta won tin kuro leni ibi kan lawon obi ti bere suru na ni papo to fi le se tebi to hun ri ko to wole oko a si ni be lati ko awa na nja la nba ka akiri nu so enikan na fe enikan ba joko to ba se benike o tu ma da sugbon ta won meyeji ba jo joko to jo se papo ton ja la nba to tun won ti pe hun ile yi na la pada si ton se gbogbo e de ifo kan ba le awa ile ajele alayo ajele musulumi ododo ajele alalubarika so igbe ni be a je ron fun oko aya ati awon omo te ka awon omo to ba jade ni be na ton ba pada lo sita ta won na wole oko awon na ri iwa ku tori iwa ton ti ri kola tara baba ati ya ki se pe ka wa ma wo pe a okunrin ko ma fo ka akiri ni ibun lata o ti to awon omo okunrin wa our male children we need to teach them to let them know that the home is important it is not just going outside walking about but that you two must do some home chores respect the women folk then with that o ma to ba respect obirin won le gbe papo pelu won o ni ma wo pe a eni eleyi lo ye ko se bayi o ni o ye ko se bayi iwo na wa mo pe gbogbo ala gbojo ojo se papo ki ile yo fi je ile alayo ibun ta ba wa nabi wa sallallahu alaihi wasallam so fi gbogbo e sile fa won iyawo o ti won la nabi to ba wa nle a o na tu ba won iyawo sise le won la nabi ma ran aso ara e a nabi ma nse gbo ma nsa wo o ma nsa wa da pelu awon iyawo ibun to ba fe lo bi ka mu iyawo kan da ni gbogbo kan be eyan ka won ko ni na mo pe gbogbo ati se le nikan owo iyawo ko lo wa atokunrin atobirin ni gbogbo e da le lowo bo te je pe owo obirin na la wo pe o po ju si so gbogbo wahala to nsele ni le aye ile ni gbogbo wa atoko ati iyawo lo ye ka jo moju to ki gbogbo e o fi leto ki gbogbo e o fi da alhamdulillah mi wo ti ni ko lodo yin odo yin na mo i'm still with you ma you mention incompatibility the other time mufe ki e ba buju oyan because ta ba wo ibi ta wa wa ni si ari pe most people most couples come from uh, most especially africa some other places come to america after to get pe ba ya ati kawidi abati rise kan nkan kan sha ma se de tu ma mu gbe yawo yen break tu ma mu le yen break mo afi ke ba buju lo da para ni incompatibility yen ki ni ma fa to fi ri be ajo mu gbe po dada ni ka to debi igba ta debi to eh ba ya okoran yawo ni iwe ni abi yawo na support oko ni sowo yen ni abi mi mo incompatibility yen ki le mo fe ke ba portress e 
keje o ya wo eyan wa ki lo fa kini solution si ti incompatibility ba wa laarin iyawo atoko se kan fi ra won le ni how can they amend it okay um te ba wo incompatibility en o be la tori se ba ke mo bere awon ibere kan so who do you want to marry and why are you marrying that person mo ma o ma kan ti o mu yawo wale ori omo to ye ko un senator o wa so fa won obi e pe o ma ran omo e wa sile ka won obi leri so won ni gba to omo yen dele iye e lo n so fa wa pe omo yen wa da o wa daruko omo o pe omo o fi kan ran sile sa won obi e so da won obi a fi opportunity yen ri omo yen so bo se mu nkan fa won obi e pe a eni bayi bayi ni kin fun yin ni nkan yi won ni the way to se fi le awon lowo ko ti e fi pe ko ti e kun le die ko fi tomo yoruba se ko ti e fi wa han won ni bo se shetan to lo bayi ta won awon tete po mo pe e ri yawo pe o ti ri yawo won lo mo yen ni ah omo to omo te so yen omo to ni first class ni kini ko kini confused e to read ye lo an so fun pe e ti ri yawo first class ko lo ma se yawo fun e ni le o Nikin she iwa. So, bobo wa sha wo iwa yi kato fe ni ta fe. Kini yi jita she fe ni ta fe. An ingba ta wa ni bi, bobo en lo me lo me lo. Bo ingba to debi ti wa uti han. Wani e fini wa ko si ba she bo, o ma han ni. Ba to ba debi ti wa the true person will come out. Situations lo ma fa. O ma to ba je, o ma gidi. Omo to ba je omo gidi to je omo alubarika ko siru awon situations to ma sele no e ma ri pe iwa yen o ni sonu iwa si ma jade omo to ti ni wa lati le ni e no ko siru condition to le ba re o yo ba re ni lu oyin bo ni o o ba re laarin awon ore hmm iwa si ma je yo pe eh eh wa ni omo atijo lo mo yi abe e ti gbo ri to wa ni ah iyawo e omo atijo ni atijo ni ki sa omo ode ni o ni tiju so gbo e da lori iwa incompatibility ta n so yi igba te wa nbi e wa compatible o ni gbe all of a sudden e de be eyan tan awon situations kon sele o de ni to je pe e woju to e ti o di ke gbe e gbe wo lo nkan e gbe awon to ti fi oko sile so if she is good in herself Then I mentioned something again, God-fearing, God-conscious person. Mm. A God-conscious person will remain a God-conscious person. Allah. If you keep it over to find that right. Mm. If you keep it over to find that right. So, on the other hand, America, you don't think we divorce in Meta Kobo. Even in Nigeria, why? There are some cultural cultures in Nigeria too that don't see any big deal in divorce. Mm. Not only in diaspora, in within our Nigeria, yeah, we have a culture, a cultural group that it, there's no stigma concerning divorce. Oh. So they also do it. You see, some people, you see a woman who has been married five times, eight times. So Bogueno has to do with the foundation. Did you marry a God conscious person? Why did you marry that person? Gentle people, fine. Se to pa won e bi e lowo anabi ni gbogbo idipa ta teyan le fi fe yawo owo ni e bi e ni o iwa pe in to leju ni pe in to seju pa ma ba ni be ni pe ko je ni to ni iberu olohun to ba ni beru olohun ko si bi to ti pa ko si bi to ba re ti o ni pada di pe yastic olohun lo ma lu lati fi ma se yastic ara e in se yastic awon egbe aba won eyan to nlo kat so that is just a basic solution marry a god conscious person marry somebody with good attitude both of them must go together god consciousness good attitude if those two things are there all other things will fall into place she oko lose ise ni she igba yi pada ni she pada debi kan to je pe boya ori na fin rin ni ohun o ni tu tori yen ko bere si ni fori rin ese to fin rin yen na to ro mo di to n se nfe se rin o ma pe ile oko to n wa o n fi sin olohun ni mo se lecture kan bi kan won ni marriage as an act of worship ta ba gbo agbaye agboye 
igbe yawo agboye marriage a ri pe ibun bo ko ba nsese ku se to ko iyawo hu wa ki wa ka wo wo pe ah je ki nse kini ki fi gba lada lodo lo this is 50% of my dean 50% pe marriage is 50% all the other aspects agba we ni o ayan saka alo haj 50% ri oku o so fun marriage lati je 50% ka mo pe ki se awada ki se awada rara well, lots of work ni so go put so with this consciousness ani lati se lecture lori marriage kan we yo mo ki lo wa involved latori pe ta lo fe fe so ta ba ti mo pe it's 50% of my dream then i can't just marry anybody i have to marry somebody that will make that 50% easy for me to practice and for it to be 50% a lot of things we go into it and a lot of trials we also rare it how do you surmount? How do you solve these things together? So that attitude of we are in this together, yeah. we are in this together, knowing the integrity of marriage, what is it all about? 50% mm. of our deal, then mm. we'll get it right. So mm. there's need for enlightenment, there's need for consciousness. Turn when you're late, come on. Can you marriage and so in she, I love you to our career, our affair, our and for different reasons. How we often fair our granny, low you go to the people of fashion, but to the people, the only person available and moting were over age. So any man that comes, I pick it goes beyond that, it goes beyond mm -hmm. that. So we need to be conscious and realize the sacredness of marriage, that it is an act of worship. They are Nisha Bashu Bashu, Nisha Bushu, Ashe Bushu, Yakashi. Pole, you bush your quarry. Ah, she bush your cash in a lucery, bush your lily. Alhamdulillah, Robella Lemin. Columba, she that I found my way. A very dear Babuju Kiliwadi Nali, that I could eat do none. Columba Muli Waduru could see the two in the challenges. It said, see the two in the upsand doing tea now. Key Columba Muli Waduni. Maloso do yawa a kiwu shola. Eh, maloso do yawa ki ushola. Nge taba wuilele ni. Mm, taba wuilele ni. Gege bi ya shingufe ki anya nana wan oro kanti eti sose yina ni. Kali gwa goye, kali losi biti afe fuli so ni bi. Ah, awan question wa yi. Taba wu, ala yile nani. Be afe fe, afe fe ya wu. Opolo pole ni man wu be, I need someone that is religious and educated. Who are religious? Who are educated? Abi ko are religious? Abi ko je pi enti ya ko kila ma ko yano to to ni fashion to shikini to a conscious meje jina fe gbiye wo. Chuba kaka pi awa se sole kan wani eniti owa to a conscious of Almighty Allah to a conscious of what ya he or she is doing. Taba meje kini balance ti I tell if you wo meje jipe lu inti iya wa so yen ti de le fi dun nitori pe ta ba ri en ti o wa kan se o so je pe yen be ya ko ni degree be ya degree to de ni ko ti ni masters tori opolopo lo ngoju ori diaspora ta wa le ni lati fe bi eyin na ta jo wa diaspora tori opolopo lo ma je kini ri be bi pe ngba to fe tan eh ko ni degree de degree lo ni ko ti ni phd tori opolopo iya lo ma so be o ma nkan pa ni pe o ma ti o ba ma ta ma ma fe o gbodo ni phd o gbodo ni iruse bai sugbon to wa god conscious ni en gangan ki le yin ri si afe ke yin ba gbodu yen o wa lead wa lo si question ti ma tun wa bi yin le relata e ba gbodu wo yen se consciousness ni ka wo ni abi mejeji na la gbodo wo abi mejeji na lo ko ti en ba fe fe lo gbodo ni abi ya o ti en ba fe fe se mejeji na lo gbodo ni Eti mi utara yin. Eti mi utara yin. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. Thank you once again for that question. Um, I'm going to start from where, from some of the points that my mommy mentioned earlier on. We, um, you sh when, when somebody is going into marriage, that you should know that you are going into this marriage, you are going into, we are together in it. So like you said, that should 
somebody look at uh, maybe consciousness or the fear of God or the social aspect, you know, of going into a marriage and that some women want um, like an enlightened person for their sons or their daughters to marry. So when we are going into a marriage, marriage is a thing of, um, it's a lifetime situation. It's a lifetime contract. It's not where you go in the morning and you come back in the evening. So once you are gone, you are gone. You are, you are in need, you know, till the rest of your life, all things being equal. So when you are going into a lifetime contract, so you need to go into it with your, your, your eyes wide open. So you are not going to go into it with mere infatuation or mere feelings. So lots of things need to go into it. I will, I will make example of some, um, some tribes, I, I think some tribes in India. We used to practice this in the past. You know, our forefathers used to practice it, where they were, where they are the one that's going to choose, you know, a, a a wife for their sons to marry. Like maybe I want my daughter or my son to marry my my friend's daughter or or something like that. But unfortunately, in our society, it's not working. But let's take example of this Indian tribe. So is the parents, when, when a man or a woman is of age or getting married, the parents know that it's their responsibility to look for a spouse for their daughter or for their son. They are the one that is going to do their own due diligence. They are the one that is going to find about this lady or about this man. They're going to go into the family, look at the family background, look at the educational background, Look, look at the social background of the person. Then they are going to match. They are going to look at the educational background of the of the of the the two parties. So they want them to be compatible. They want them to go hand in hand, so that you know they will be able to assist each other emotionally, financially, you know everything that involves in the marriage. So that when the storm starts, they'll be able to wither through it together. So the, if if a woman, if a lady is like a, um, a degree older, they're not going to look for somebody who is a college uh, dropout or who is a um, high school dropout for a degree older to marry. So they're going to look for equivalent degree for their wife, for their daughter to marry. So, yeah, and you see that these people, they don't know each other before coming together, but with the arrangement, they now get them introduced. The, 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 the husband side have done their own due diligence. The wife side have done their own due diligence. They're they now going to introduce this uh, man and woman to each other so that they can know themselves and they go into the marriage. And it's working very well for them. Mm -hmm. So if that is working, why will it not work for us? Why can't we look into the person that we want to go into marriage? If I want to marry somebody that is a degree older, or I want somebody that is older than myself, I'm going to look for that person. I'm going to look for the, for the degree, you know, it's qualification. I'm a degree older. I want somebody that is, has master's degree so that, you know, maybe his position will be a little bit higher than my position or his income is going to be a little bit higher than my, my income. I usually say something in my university days. I always tell people that I want to be rich. I want to be wealthy. But irrespective of what I have, I want my husband to have more than I have so that I can give him you know, the respect of a husband and he will be able to perform his duty as a husband. I'm not going to, you know, compete with him. So if we have that at the back of our mind, we should have plans of what we want. And then we should go into, into it with our plans, with our eyes wide open. So I wouldn't expect somebody that is, you know, a PhD older to go and marry a dropout or because of the person is beautiful or she's socially inclined or something. It's not going to work. Because at the end of the day, a year or two into the marriage, then you realize, oh my God, she's not even up to my task. She's not even social. I can't even go out with him. She doesn't know how to dress or she doesn't know how to do things. She can't clean, you know. So there will be so many, um, um, what is it called, complaints. So why not look for somebody that you know is going to measure up to your standard from the word go. 
So we need to look at financial background. We need to look at the educational background. We need to look at the social background. So we need to look at everything. So have a plan of what you want and how you want it. So if you see somebody, bring the plan out. That is the essence of, you know, something that we are not doing, but is very, very important. This marriage seminar or marriage, you know, uh, lectures before going into marriage. So know your spouse, know each other. You know, if there are some financial constraints, table everything. So I mean, so, so, so amount of debt. Make a plan of how you want to start paying the debt or make a plan of how you want to, you know, how many children do you want to have? Uh, you know, if you don't make all these plans, when things start happening in the, mar in the marriage, there's no how you will be, you know, the love you have before you go into the marriage, there will be some challenges that will make the love to reduce. Not that the love will reduce like that, but there will be some stress that, you know, you have to, ha you have to handle. It's normal. But when you have a plan and you already have how you want to go about it, it will make your, your task a little bit easier once you are in the, in the marriage. So for, from my own, own part, point of view, I will say that you should look out for everything if not 100%, maybe 95% of what you want in your man and what you want in your woman. And another thing is not your parent that is going to live with the, with the woman or the man. So look for what is satisfying to you, not what is satisfying to your parent. Though that is true. But you know, there are some things that it's you yourself and the and the person involved that is going to, you know, deal with the situation, not your parents. So you should you should you should have what you have. I mean, know what you want, and then you can use your parents' ideas or parents' advice as a guide. You know, so religio religiously is, is, is religion is very, very important. If you marry and if you're a religious person, you marry an unreligious person, it, it, it's not going to work. Maybe it's when you are praying that she knows that she wants to be, be singing or dancing a hip hop dance or, you know, she wants to be doing something else. So you just be, be, be you know, biting yourself while you are, while you are praying, but she doesn't, she doesn't care. Because she's not into that all religious, uh, all the spirituality before you marry him or her. And then you are thinking that when you marry somebody, you're going to change the person. Don't think of changing anyone because it may not go in, it may not go all out well. So it's hard. Most of the um shake her. If you think about my break, so so you can you can wait for 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 the fish to dry before you you want to amend. If you want it like a curved fish, you better put it in that shape before you 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 try to grill it or to to dry it. But if you wait until you dry it, then you are going to break the person. So if you know that there are some things you don't like in a, in a person, and you think that person can change before you go into the marriage, tell the person I don't like this. And I appreciate if we can do this or that. But you're thinking that when you get into the marriage that you'll be able to enforce. You don't enforce anything on anyone. You can't. It won't work because that person has his life. So you don't want to be an abusive husband or abusive, maybe physical, physical abusive, uh, uh, physically abusive or emotional. You don't want to be any of that. So ditto, you don't want anybody to feel that, you know, that person is being relegated or that person is thinking that, you know, I'm at the mercy of someone. So all those things need to, to be put in into consideration. You really need to look at all those. They are very, very important things to look at before going into marriage or before choosing a life partner. Yeah, I'm like, hey, and uh, we, we are dodging all, most of the scholars are dodging the, uh, to answer the question or to debate on it, which is very, very germane. And uh, when we said homes, only the issue of barren in local love making. When we look at that school at our one bay, Elijah, open she shall meet her, she shall marry, yeah, where they expect her to perform excellently to bad delay, and to the she shall latter, thank you, reading book, or Matty Sale, to see delay of her to perform that. A lucky Gibbon, yeah, wuna, yeah, to get me talk about today, or by night duty love to she can and what they expect it make you won't come back now. All actually, but good way, lay, take a bill, love making, nilly, 
ti je pe n da wa ala ale ti o si ni se so pe n tin fa jalele ko ni se so pe nkan to fa jalele a kan ma binu se la wa ni a kan ma se ogbe ni awon yan ti bo wa pari e won ma se de pari e tori pe ko se so won ti tan ba te okun ni na tan ba te obinrin ninu lori eleyi e ba gboju o kini islam so lori e kini to e ka se si a se lagbara jura wa lo bismillah she mister dara alaja wa alhamdulillah Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, Hirobili Alami. Saba wo esetala an sheyi. Oni Islam is the total way of life. Wo go everything, lo ti ni alayi, ni no Islam. Saba wo love making. Oni elitoba lo she illegally e she ni. I wato oba she the right way, bi Islam she so. La da wa ni be. Is yeah. is a rewardable act. Mm. So you doing it even to the satisfaction of your wife. There is reward for it, because if you do it wrongly, it's a sin. So if you do it correctly, there is a reward. Then what does Islam say again concerning the wife? Where there is no excuse for any woman to say no to the man. When it's your koba sokoya. Si o bini ba so po ti ti ki shekwe bo yoni valid reason. Wala ma laika ma shekwe fun o bini ye. Ti 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 le ma fi ma. Abi ti to koma fi yon nou si mi. Then, I want valid reasons. Wala lo le mu o bini so po yon ti ki yon koma su mo. Ala wan kanye ni. So bini ba nshe yon kon shu. Kura an gan so ni sura tu bako a vras 222. Pe ti o bini ba nshe yon kon shu. Ki yon koni ma wo le to. Den ti yon bini ban. Ta le o ba ya. O le sokwe o ti fun o koni. Den ta le ba wo bo sinia ro si. E paint. Kwe o bini ti shishen lo. O koni ti shishen lo. Igba mi o le jekwe akpak lo fi si. Ka pak e jini o wo ni satisfaction. O wo yene kanko wo. Ni bita a wanan. O si biti ki ni yon o ti nda wa ala si le. I want to come out here with one lag bar. Oh, believe me, what you pay? Cock, quack, 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 lorry. Only satisfaction to your kill you are. And the coward, logic alone, one in your speech to one rush or coney can't do. On foam, Lenu. So one of two are obvious pay. On by a well look for lower. For your own loan, loan, you totally call it satisfy your work. Oh, no far stress in it. Oh, you're coming here. What hypertensive? Tell me. Allah. What coming here? You talk coming here. Balloni. We want to answer. You know, only shake below understanding. Only shake below understanding. At your boy, your hour. We need to understand ourselves. Of course, it is not all the time that a woman must say no, 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 no. If if she say no now, I should try and understand. Kilo day. Ah, oh, Benny, to she lo, oh, to she double double. I be double double, no, co. Oh, to she double double, no, Lori Kinney, Lori go, go, ada, ada, lea, ye, what I'm back, I none. Ada, ada, lea, ye, what I'm back, a titi, go, bone tea, oh, ye, cash, ye, four hour, cafe jog, bad, war hour, a ray, ye, four month. I want more gunner, one, you are bad. Kilo Jawa, we discussing this topic today. It's because of all these. Things that we have put ourselves into. That there's nothing like moderation again. The Prophet Sallam said, Your body has a right over you. Only away, your metal loba, Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Only because of where, oh mama, oh mama, shadow, titi, tile mafimo. Ikoni, oh mama, bawe, lo titi, titi, titi. Only Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, so fun, oh, ah, ah. Are gonna let you, oh, God, oh, see me. Ya wè nan lè to, si e, mba to ba shè adwa la ta rò da lè, pa o lo jefè ra yè gò ti ya wè. Abi wò nan to lò fè gba wè, o ni jè wè, wà mag ba lò jò jù mè. So kamò kwe, i ya wò lè to, o kò lè to, pi o kò ba de to ba lò ya, ki se wò wò ba lò la mamma sò, o ti, o ti, e shò mò kwe, mò ti ba, dò bu dò bu lò mò shè de, o ti rè yara. Ka fi a yè si, fun gò gò a wò, i bè si a yè, Kayo le dun. 
Come off, you go, she and da da wa wa wa, and she shares, she shares, she shares, she shares. Come on, I eat bad water. Come on, I eat bad away, nurse. Come on, more government at one, I eat bad one. Only Kalu could see law, and one more known that I want to talk. I want to talk with television, no more fidar, I want to talk, and talk about software, no more fidar, I want to talk. Or call let or call letter, Lord Obin, Obin, and let or Lord Oya, and when Jotty and Shero sit and none. In terms of non yet communication. Oh, ye ki a ye wa la re or kwa ti ya wo. Even be ya wo ba fe. Ki ya wo le ya no beri lodo o ko. Ko yon si ya won sain. Ta fi beri lodo o ko ko to mo fe ka bay. Mo fe ko o sumami. Mo fe ko o she bay. So, go go wala ta mbaka ni le a ye ina ta ba le mo go go e ni yi won tu won si. Ta mo kwe ya wo le to si wa. Or call it or see what our Arawa girl let us see what Sabah go where she was. See what two you want to go where I load you to. I load you to the Tabatu Le Master or Sita a Jota Le Benny Ketaruni. But can we talk to ourselves? Communication. Communication is vital. All the problems we are having today. If it, it can if it can be discussed between the man and the woman, you will nip it at the board. Hmm. Ah, even marriage of how many years you should know the sexual level of your wife, you should know the sexual level of your husband. So, but we're not tolerance, endurance, compatibility, understanding ourselves, all these things are vital. Communication. Whatever the problem, let's sit down and discuss it. Ah, kokun yo mo to ba ba ye we lo kwe gan si ya we o ba ba ne kokun yo le mo. Pia ya we mi o ba jun kini kini mo le she ke jo soro kini mo le she si o file ba jun kini. Abi ki ya we gan le kwa kwe a kokun mi o ba jun kini. Kama ma fi bo kwe she mo ti she lo mi o le she to ba fi se gbe kan wala ni. So bo kwe no compatibility, bo kwe no communication. Mm. Whatever issue, ah, go go balo mama she oti 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 kilo de. He ya wona le sorti eti tako ke buy ni buy ni. He ya wona if wa to jeko fe phone ke ya kono she buy phone. She ya kono me to jeko boya. Oh she go go eto. So ba wa deleti inu ya kono badu si ya wo. Abi nu ya wo badu soko. O si bi arashe le da aralong. So come on, people, but can you invite her? Can we lay a ye mama? Can they understand that our whatever problem to budge? Can she so kiss people by lay roof? Can you get her? But I lay roof on our our. Can we make we are in this together for life? Can you go to our our sorrow? Can we go to our school? To lay by our way sorrow. We buy, buy, buy. Don't shame you, fair. If you want to our school, to lay by our way. We buy, buy, buy. Don't shame you, fair. So the Kosia here, Nita, Islam of Faragba infidelity. Islam of Faragba Shina. Islam of Faragba Shina Rara. Zero tolerance. Islam Nifu Shina. So Sabale Joko Kajo Daro for a Kajo Soronik by. We are all match to shake in it. Okay. Can't say a job Google kill a leche. Go go and go go and go and go and go and go Discuss it together. Okay, your joke. Okay, okay. He la tun le she la ti fi muki ni ti e wa ife because gbo gbo kan na ni jo aye gbo gbo kan na ni jo marriage gbo gbo kan na gbo gbo awon ara kini mi in to nje ki bonding wa gbo gbo lockdown to sele lo won lo je ki oko ati yawo gbo oko foka akiri ko saye mo iyawo na foka akiri e ko kan loku online ni pupo gbo gbo se so je ki bonding wa la rin oko ati yawo na se ri pe awon okunrin to le tolerate yawo won gan tele tele Need domestic violence now. She turn right. So let's bond. Let's learn to bond together. Let's learn to talk about these things. Let's learn to discuss this issue. Let's make it a topic of discussion. Especially in Hindu Islam, Mama will put sacred topic. Me, I got a sorrowing mind. Even Lawu Jo, he only a leche couples program. Me a salatu naga. Cause we are experts. So Baba was sorrow. Lori and Wakini. So no matter how tired your wife is, I will not she leave. That will make her so interested. But Moshele Jia call me today. That will make him so interested. Experts can handle this. We can learn to have these topical discussions as part of our programs. Kojela and couples. Let's have it. Let's discuss these issues. Let's 
not make it something too sacred to be talked about. Because oh, a lot of lot of things don't silently for marriage. So silently, Jackie Shina Kowale. In tone one time, you can make your wife do it for you. You can make your husband do it for you. People can discuss together. Say Jia Gugu, say Jia Shele, say Jia Shele. Even there are so many Islamic sites that you can use. As father can handle this mature setting. Let's not make it too sacred a topic. Let's talk about it, husband and wife. Let's talk about it now within our society. Okay. Assalamualaikum <laughs> Canada, <laughs> Question For instance, we conversation Tabi ya woshi mani conversation kwa lu exe. Ono wole ki ili shikbi iti ya wako tabi ya wu. Wole fi voli go on fi voli. Ba wole ya koi andwe. Loro to ba doro ex. Because sometimes wako lo iba. To ya ya wako ni. Kuma asora alaji ya atale mba asora. Awo mwa folake ni folake folake kono. Eda kum ya wako wole ya ki. Oko tabi ya wu. Kumani ji ex wu. When it comes to their home. Ye je. Iberi I because I discovered as well when it comes to finance. But we you know, Poloba, we are to report Brino now for near tissue. You said, I see Tabio Brino now for near tissue. Oh, my dear, I walk when you got your queen or you say, when it comes to you know, in you know, me, you don't know, need implication for co financial spiritually. See, I'm going to be so busy. So, okay. Um, salam alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Shemo le down by. Nam, eh e down by to ri pe question ti mo bele only part 2. Mo fe ke down yele down. E down na. Down na mo. Okay. Okay. Um Financial responsibility in the question cage in the motif February. Taba wo Taba waya Quran chapter four verse thirty four. Ye kilo so okonini along be a ye ye fu. But along be a ye ye fu okonino mink be obini uli shin a lower. But copy ni kama makbe in tone fisi. Even ni Nigeria na talan wa koni longbe. Ok polo pole obirin shen na lowo. Yata ba wa reality ni. Ok polo pole obirin longbe. Even ni Nigeria. Then in tone wa mbe ni kbe a ye o koni ni. To ba di kobirin shen na lowo ko sin to buru ni be. Sugba ko ye ko kun ni o joko ko wa lo nlo un pin. 
o ye ko kun ojo ko pe ibi kibi to n ba wa ko n ni agbara lati gbe gbogbo responsibility ni mi ro pe o wa impossible lati ri okunrin at america at canada at gbogbo europe pata ka ma ri okun to ye po ni kan lo ngbe financial responsibility le te ke boya little additional things ni awo kan se is not impossible and i think i have one or two examples of that in London, in America. So if they bear the financial responsibility of the home, a man should not sit down to say he's the one sharing. It's like you are sharing your blessing, your reward with your partner. I do an ikbe, allow you continue to give him that wherewithal mm. to play that financial responsibility in the home. Then I told me now, and look at me. We want to talk about physical health. A woman too has to be content. So if she's adding, come up with a minimum add. So she can add. Oh, but now let's share a shake. But come here, but you are going to need to go to the job. Oh, still, oh, yes. Eh, a minimum to go away. Okay, you want to look at my go away. Wani bi ani po kuni kui alubari kai on kui fo biyani ni on bi alubari kai fu biyani. But reality bita wa okay gaga bi yawa ke ushola she so that most times you find women being favored in this country and women earn higher than the men. Shari we elimi. Every example we have is in our prophet. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. The Bible of Sufu, I know, Surah to Azar, verse 21. In the Prophet of Allah is what? That example that we need. Yes. Lakari kana lakon fi rasul ilai. Usuwatu asana. Asana. But in the Prophet of Allah is that example you need. Khadija yawa anabi akoko. Oma lowoja anabi lo. Onko lo tu employ anabi. But still, kogbagbara oko lo wa anabi. O shikba fungege bi oko. Ibata anabi ikbe. Toti, tolo mbele sini. To sodo jishe. O wala ramoto. To koko kba islam. So to one a buyer, to to fill us all the uncle. So in a way, ni to earn more than oko should not see it as an avenue. But yes, multi di oko, oko na ori na lori shi bado maje lori alubari ka fuare ati awomwe. Lori alubari ka fuare ati kini o ati awomwe. Kini she fare ni kama ni marriage is an act of worship. So I really like ya nabi, but oko wa godo jo koko lo unpe. But if naturally office odo ya wojo akoni lo, polo nche nche ni e. Deki ya wogo mokwe adon wo ni fo wo, wo le godo shilo. Tori gbogbo e lo ma pada jiche, tori gbogbo wa na la daraje, gbogbo na de la ma jiche pada fo lo. We are all guidance. Then ti a koko tanso ni pa ex. And you know, we any X. X should be X. Past tense. In it. There mm. should be no relationship between you and your ex. Because we that in a way for that relationship between you and your ex. Laying that out to marry her. While and see the enjoy your. Oh, believe me, what of her married all of fellow full ex you only wedding invitation. So they bet the ex in it. Ah, ah. Eh, koti e to lo finali te jia shere egbe yi. Ton shere egbe yi. Ton shere ya wo lo se ke ji. So ya kpo mba ton yu ma de. Omo o ma shomo toko. Omo ex ma lo kwa da jasi. So, taba ti mo kwe ni iti di ex. Kwe da o koni ni o, o beri ni o. With all integrity. Ex should be ex. Should be part of your past. And nothing, nothing against you bring both of you together. Because 
whatever brings you together will always have an evil ending. So when you lose your phone, you pay X. Your wife can never, never be happy. If you want a happy home, you shouldn't. Whether your wife knows about it or not, eh? But unless she near any relationship, koko pelu X. I talk all at yawo. So it is forbidden. I will say that it is because she no lo ma pada beye. And all avenues, to le lead si she na. Anything, to le lead si any forbidden act is also forbidden. So there are some things that are haram, not in themselves, but because they can lead to haram, all those things become haram themselves. You having a relationship with your ex will lead to zina. So it means mm. don't call your ex, don't have any relationship with your ex, whether you are a woman or the man. It is not, it will have an evil end. It is like your opening means to an evil end. And that end is a prohibited end. So we should respect that. Respect your wife. Respect your husband. No relationship with your ex. It down me. Alhamdulillah, get to Loma. I'm a Yawa come on. Sorry, be the question. Can you pay to bag you pay if the if they had kissed before they separated? To be shangbe and a country if any carry the matty be more si benyeri she could go to ni bashi po ma or coyan to tibi mofu tetelego to fellow me. And shamma iru i bashi po yen lori or money is a lani and one majeji lori or mo all a jay to wash around one arrangement to pay boy or coyan ni or what of fear or share ni party to a woman. So iru yen. Abashe kwa ome je jiko ni je abashe kwa to wa secret. Aje abashe kwa to je kwe partner. Aeli to she efe ye na mamon kwa. So koni di kwe afe kwa di an kwa di ni bi tike ji. Ti ya wo mi o ti kwa do ori wa. Ibi to kwa mi o ti kwa do ori wa. So iru ye, whatever relationship to wa la ari wan to ri a wan mwa ye. O ma han si eni tan fe. Koni si boju boju kakani ba debi kwe aye shi na. Yo ba yo. Lati be. The kotuni din toja kwe aja ki ya ni to wa ni le. Koma feel jealous. Abi koma feel threatened. Abi koma feel insecure. So, whatever ties. Toba shi wala ni wan to ri a wan mwa ye. Oma jen toja kwe wa open to everybody. So, koni jen kwe boya. Boju boju kama wambe. De ifu iru ya gan. Omo o ni la. Toba ye kok obi ni. Koni la ti malo so adwe. Tisikali la ti ba. Oh, there are so many means. So let me follow us. So if you there can be a third party in between them. Last year, Tima Faye, but he she not to share any anyone. Hmm. Nam. Kinto losodo ya wa kiushola. Akpa keji ile temba bote tele ni injuda boko ni biya wuni tabati binu sirawa kujepe ibi onu yela Tima Faye gerawa injuda be. Ala yawa unike. Oh. She mo kwe mo sona mo ni islam o faragba ki ya wo fi oru du oko. Ben. Kwe mo ni ti oko ba bere fun. Ti ya wo ba sopo ti. Mo ni a maleka ma ma shekwe fun wo bere ye. Ti le ma fi mani. The same way mo ni to bere ba ti o ba toro a ye lo do oko to fi jade lo ni le. This is to my fellow, to my fellow. I'm like I'm a man shake with fun. So, boy, I want Johnny, I want Johnny. Oh, Billy, oh, Nia, to let us talk about it. I say so, we go and we are here. To let Jacob be in his talk with us, if we want to. They go and come now, mama. So, Billy, to Jacob, boy, I love you out to. So, I say, Papa, even I'm going to take back on Tony. To my talk, we are only for me, only for me, me on the Tony. Ah, oh, but she is going to leave me for Philo. So, he go and share skills, man. So, Islamically, is not right. But you to the one Janio, one Janio, Kio Biri, one Mau Kwai, Bade Dale, Bade Dibat. Ah, she be momenti ti mamwe. Ah, muti wa shukuto fwe. She be wani momenti. So, it is very, very wrong. 
Tabani, go me see o me oto, go me see o me oto. Let's settle it. In she that aspect. Go go e na lori a go ye na ni. Go go e na lori a em. Kala ma jati ara o ko wa ko lu o long. Ki o ko na ma ti ara iya wo ko lu o long. Ile mi wa te ko bi ni lo fe kini yo to ko ni fe si. Se o ko na ma o ko ya she bi wo ni ma she she give one. So it's vice versa. So o ko o bo do fi do iya wo iya wo no o bo do fi do oko is both ways nam oro yi eni a gbodo bu enu ni ori e tori oro yi le na la nso ile na ni o gbe mi lo sodo ya wa ke usola yo ke mi sodo awon ya wa ke usola insha allah kolon ba se dada olon ba mo le wa duro tori nti topic ti agbere le ni nti o kenu ni wallahi o kenu asigbodo fomo die eh ali ma de fomo le ni sugbon agbodo fomo die eh lori question be ji ni akoko obirin ti share pe facebook whatsapp gugu ele ni aye ti du jara le ni obirin to je pe o na wa lori facebook wa lori gugu a wa re ni ti yawo le ni o won kenu fe si lati ori facebook a fe fe a fe si gugu e to lo won o ko gba sugbon bi o se gba yen o n gbe ni yen na chat de ni yen na o ton so nkan ti e ki won ma so si ra won nge ru be so le mu le duro akoko ni yen elekeji e ba gboju o yen e le ba tun fe loju a ni fe loju ju be yen lo elekeji airo mo bi ninu ile kokunrin wa abi obirin ti won ma ti bi mo Mm, but only, how can we handle this? How can we handle it? I think we should get to blame any kind of lawyer. Lay me a picky little cash. I have um, so the first question is about uh, somebody on social media, uh, maybe having some someone having a crush on someone on social media. So, how should a person handle this? Uh, first and foremost, it's not out of order to have somebody to have a crush on another person. It's not out of order to have a man having secret feelings for an opposite party, you know, aside his wife. But what is important is maturity, the intelligence, the emotional intelligence to be able to handle such a situation. There are so many people on Facebook, on Instagram, on Twitter, on all those social media that, you know, they don't uh, disclose their identity, maybe their marital identity, their children, their husband, or their wife, so to say. So there are some men out there that are looking for a genuine wife. And, you know, seeing the, the profile of this person, they may think, well, you know what, uh, maybe if I chat this person or, you know, I may be able to get what I want. So a woman that know that she is married and if anybody makes such passes at her, she's supposed to let the person know that, I am sorry, I am a married woman. What you are trying to tell me is not going to work. Please stop such a thing. Some people will not stop you know at that they want to probe further they will think that they any to code any to code relent they will be remarked back from later then that woman needs to put her feet down and be factual with him or with him that you know what don't ever call me again don't ever discuss this thing with me again in your life that is it. I'm not interested. That man, that woman should come out boldly and she'll be factual. So Kosi Eric Okoni no pe in your the opposite says, Oh, oh boy, you know it cannot work. Because you know, and there are some people that they will they will accept, they will know you, they know that you are serious. And if you, they know that they, 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 there are some serious type that, you know, what they want is what they want. And the moment you let them know, they know that, and they leave you. 
they may say, okay, you know, we can be friends or something like that. So in that situation, the woman needs to let her husband know, but you know what, I have this person, this is the situation of things. There's no point hiding anything. If you know that you don't have any skeleton in your cupboard, or you know that at the end of the day, you are not going to have anything to do with that person. So that is that is that about, um, you know, having somebody, you know, having crush crush on you. So it's vice versa. That's why we said commitment in a relationship or in a marriage is very, very important. Because when you are committed to your marriage, you will know that those, you know, infatuation that you are having, is a feeling that will come and go at, a, you know, some point in time. But your love for your wife and your children and your commitment to your home, you know, will help you to deal with that impulse when it happens. So anybody, Lule Shelesi, but the maturity with which you can handle it, it matters a lot. Then another one, childlessness in a home. Do we blame someone uh, or something like that? Um, it's unfortunate that, you know, sometimes there will be childlessness in a home, involuntary childlessness in a home. We are not supposed to blame anyone because we are not God. It's only Allah that disposes one's affair. We all plan. We don't have the capability, you know, to make our plans come to reality. We want something, we wish for something, but if Allah says no, there's nothing we can do. Hmm. No one is to be blamed for childlessness in a home. But unfortunately, our women from, you know, the parts of the country that we come from, our women are most of the time being blamed for, you know, childlessness. To me, that is a gross misconception because it's not only women that has fertility issues. So thinking that maybe a man can, you know, have erection, can perform well in bed, can ejaculate and so on and so forth, does not mean that that, that man is fertile. That man may be having so many other infertility, you know, challenges going on. The man may have low sperm count. The man, the man may have varicose cell, that is, you know, the uh, uh, um, enlargement of the, the veins and the testes. The man may have STDs, that is the sexually transmitted diseases, you know, that may affect the quality of the sperm or, you know, so many other things that the man may have. So, you know, making love or, you know, having intimacy with your wife does not mean that you, that man is, uh, it's okay or that woman is free from fertility problem. So our women are not the only persons to be blamed when there is childlessness in a home. So childlessness in a home is a mutual um, challenge. It's a mutual problem and it should be seen as such. It should be dealt with as such. So a woman too, you know, there are so many things that can cause uh, childlessness in a home. The woman, like my uh, mommy said that you shouldn't sit and be praying. You should pray and then you should act. You should seek um, medical um, advice, you know, so that you do some tests, you know, as you are advised by your, uh, your family practitioner or your GP, you know, whatever you can do to, to ascertain that you are okay and detail to the man to, to you know, speak out and seek uh, health, um, help as available and as appropriate so that they know where the problem lies. So when they are able to ascertain where the problem lies, then they will know, you know, how to, to go about handling, you know, the problem so they can follow a medical advice to do whatever they ask them to do and then back those things up with prayers. So um, it's common among the, the in-laws that, you know, when uh, a woman or people married for a year or so, uh, nothing is forthcoming, especially the mother-in-law, I'm, I'm sorry to say, you know, we start counting you know, for the for the for the woman that yeah, it's been a year. I can't wait to see my children. 
I mean, to see my grandchildren, the time is ticking, you're just sitting here, you know, all sorts of things. The woman that doesn't have child, children, she's grieving already. You don't have to compound her problems. You don't have to, you know, send her to early grief. You don't have to rub salt upon the injury that she's already nursing. So you need to be able to assist her. You need to be able to, you know, accommodate her. You need to be able to pray along with her to be able to seek medical advice with her and then, you know, leave other things to God after you have done, you know, what is expected um, of you. So um, we should always uh, also accept that it's not everybody that will be a parent, you know. Some people have children and maybe they have stillbirth or they are conceiving and they are having miscarriages, you know, anything can happen that we don't have, sometimes we not have control over it. So mm. we don't have to, you know, um, belittle the woman or tag the woman or kind of label the woman as unproductive element or a worthless person. So you are not helping that woman. Then, so we should try to kind of assist her in whatever way we can uh we can do to to assist then uh, there is a, a situation of insecurity in the home too on the part of the woman so a lot to be going on in that woman's uh, mind which may eventually lead to kind of a mental health situation increased anxiety increased de depression you know lack of sleep and stuff like that because she's thinking that she's not having children. She's grieving that she's not having children. All I meet already has one, two or three children. She's looking for her own, you know, fruit of the womb. But unfortunately, she's not having it. So she wants somebody to be there for her. Such women should reach out to support group. She, she's not in the situation alone. There are other women out there, you know, that are facing the same problems, that are going through the same challenges that she is going so she can look out for support group she can look out look out for you know people that she can share her problems with uh people say that a problem shared is out if not completely um solved so uh we should try to to encourage whoever is in that in that um situation so that you know the person does not think of committing suicide or having other um, health issues uh, with child with her um, childlessness. So then, if a woman, I mean a man, has to resolve to getting another a wife because of childlessness in the home, because some some men they cherish their uh, father, you know, they want to see their children rather than you know um, looking for a, a positive, um, a peaceful relationship. So they don't have the patient. If if you want to take another wife, you should through, go through the proper channel. You should realize that this woman already has an issue or a problem that she's nursing. So you need to kind of uh, go through the proper channel, discuss this with her. It's not the, it's not it's not easy. It's hard, but it's not the end of the day. So it's better for you to to update her, to inform her. You know, tell her of your 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 decision or what you want to do, so that you both can agree. She may not agree, she may not want it, but it's better for you to say it out rather than just bringing someone in, you know, and rubbing it on her face that kubimo or 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 something like that. Uh -huh. So that kind of situation will not will not help the woman. And then no. another woman with only John Kofrade new federal way, you know what? I need to try another person. Maybe you know we are not compatible, as we said earlier on. So call call him. You know what? I've been with you for five, six, seven, eight years. I don't want to waste my time any longer. I don't want to waste your time any longer. Let's part ways. Let's look for, you know, what we can do elsewhere. So amicably, you know, you can you can you can work things out rather than labeling each other 
or blaming one person and, and stuff like that. So no one is to be blamed. Blaming women for childlessness in the home is a gross misconception because as women is bound to, as women are bound to be infertile, infertile, so also the men are bound to be infertile. When it happens, it's a challenge that needs to be faced and need to look for a way out. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala uphold us, answer our prayers, and bless those womb that are, you know, seeking for the fruit of the womb, bless them with uh, children that will be the coolness of their eyes. It's never, it's never lie. I mean, 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 I X T N so yeah, T X the bus so you be fair young pa T fairly marry after ten years or fifteen years, you know the fila one le ya won ye would any ku fe oko yang fe fe pada. So when ya wutu wa niwa ni rara u yali be rara to the fila lati be ten years, fifteen years. Eh, otu wa fe fe pada. One is only possible in Islam, so to leave pada and to the file be ten twenty years. You put it fair, Yahoo me. Yahoo me to what fair, yeah, was a way into feeling, yeah, be ten, fifteen years, yeah, could if you put a woman, you have question about the poor. Question like a G. One of Benity by our woman, which is your money. Suggest in the Balai, you are in his land. You pay only fear, I want to let you fail with me. Come on, try a lumi boots parties or come here to be. To read as a phone long by me, they could believe a month post. Or can you not date only you know? Only my jet will not let produce more. Shake by lie, you are Latin Tuka, you pay since that is ta 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 Bamba to ya or can produce more or can you are in fata? O breed a can never be must see a young kinikoshi. Yes, so I can say that the Yaw 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 um, our objectives of Sharia protection of family, protection of honor at the Gobo coin. Pay for she no Latin Marshalli. So there are our situations. Reality it is in it. The man cannot give birth, maybe the man becomes infertile. The woman wants to give birth to more children. Our Loma Dabi or Monitor. Awa magbe omo e wale to ye kwe okko o ni ma. Bobo kaba e ni olo o ni o lo di si. Bobo kaba e i lo wa e ke si islam. So the best thing on e kwe, e mi shi fe bi man si o, e wo o le bi maman. So wa ye kwe bi on e ni, wan le e separate. Kaka kwe bere se ni she shi na, kwe ma bo mwa le wale. Wan le e separate, ki o na fi lo, Fe because mm. a ye gba fun okunrin lati fe ya wo kan fe meji fe meta so ta ni ya wo ke ta ni ya wo keta x or no x to ba lo n fe fe nsin gege bi ya wa ke o so la se so ko gba normal channel oko letter lati so fun ya wo pe mo fe fe ya wo mi 
because ko da ko ba ya wo la ba di pe a ko di pe ah won se ya wo kan be ya bi sa wo ya wa ba so pe oko e ma ti fe yan pa yen ni o da rara de ti ya wo na ba ni o ti o ti o ti ya wo na ma fun ni suru o ya wo na ma fun ni suru so ko ni eto si ni ilana islam o lati fe ya wo keji lati fe ya wo keta but provided ko na o tele gbogbo awon ilana ti Along gang be kale, lati tele, lati fe ya woye. So ya woye je ex ko je ex. O le fe. Inti o bodo she kwe lu e ni kwe ko she she na. O bodo she she na kwe lu ex. O le fe. Then, o kwa ti ya woto fe ra wan. Ta o di man. Bo ya biologically. Wan si li kwe. Ki she. She wan kwe kwa mi wan ka man she medical test. Ta man ni o kwa wo ni problem. Ya wo ni problem. Bo mo wa. And I see that situation so that one me separate. So they feel that they are for coming to Padabima. So they are okay now feel they are coming to now Padabima. We see a shell in the air. We talk about one Bima phone around one. We come here. Around one year, see a long fifty a year bad divorce. It is something Allah allows, but which is something he dislikes. Mm. That's why it shouldn't be something people are using. Something people will be using anyhow. Allah permits divorce, but it's something that he dislikes. Mm. So in extreme situations, then kakakawa dikpe wala mawa ma wa ninu iru home iru idile yen or better can separate. Around one situations no ni aya na bi sasala te pe anabi ni lati ki. Paya fun or co a fire, more to repay it back, be more po, who says shimmer. So, a long fire, back, or only a toby, or paya, a me cably, to repay kinney, or magic pay one better than in Lurawa, or better than in Parawa, because one lake paya, only calicul of fair to me, or call a fair wood, anybody no lay fair, but could tell you go in an Islam, Lati fair. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alamin. Am I being no question? And true, only new. When you ask, "Salamu alaykum, Rasulullah Barakatuh," how can we promote the importance of wali in our community and also Islamic premarital counseling? When you buy lashi, they promote it. Nino, Aujoa, Elekeji. When you later I did test so you, and you can start post the question. You be, you just open it for your own okay. ibe <laughs> So ya wa ri pe ore un yi o ro ko fe o de tin dagba o pada fe obirin fun oko e bo ta o yan ma so ni pe a o lo ma pada fa gba o lo ma pada fa awo laarin yin o se o le fe iyawo foko e iyawo le fe iyawo foko e awon ya wa ti jo se dada so ti ya wo ba fi po un le se leni na o sin to so pe iyawo le fe iyawo fun Okoy, if it's any got a poor quay, who they pay ya well, so for a quay, or so for cotton tap, but go fair near, Boko, bada, fair near. But along the line, Coco shall allow your quarter, ya way not see, I ring what down. They pay me, oh boy, see, ya way, and you go fair yoke in yana, solo wool, you fair. I don't know what to walk, but I walk fair around. So go for this, she knows shelly, nearly a year lady. So, ko sinti kasha amati ko lu olon, kama she into lo di si, inti olon lo unfe. Ni kwa kwe primarita cancelling. Ki ni wa very, very vital. Iru nasfati insi, wong she cancelling. Me kanto so akwa ti ya wukpa ko. Wongbo do ke she cancelling. A wona kwe oke, iton she lo wwa igana. O she beta ju kwe kwe. But, ki ni yi, wongbo do jento je kwe, I want to find out how to train one, how to do marital counseling. How to do marital counseling. Because it's, it's a profession on its own. All need expertise. It goes beyond Afikeushe, uh, Afikinishe. 
So expertise, last the hand you I want to your team, Mary. So let me watch a quick one for I want for wrong reason. Mm. 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 She can't sell it for I want, not the mama. If she could be a cottage, I could do to cock what I would to my back for. Can I let her shake and sell it? So cut it at a better silly, she can't sell it like the better. I don't equip for the wrong reasons. Not if you don't want it anymore. When I come back to an Indian word, I want it anymore. So that's why I ah, I'm going to an Indian. She can't go. Want it to separate. We to dipe, I dipe. One fair and one wally. I want to do all that. I want to enjoy. I want to share, 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 share. Go watch, share, share. Man, I to dipe. The divorce, he no, that's on bad at me. The marital counseling can never be overemphasized. It's very, very important. Kade she. Ki a won a fa, at a won cancelos, expat, konjo wa pako, konjo she pako. A long way, lots of help, marriage, at a won katale to fi reduce divorce rate, ton shele nisi ni ye. So, bobo a won konyi lo wa important, to ekwe a godo, take into consideration, ki she kwe a konri re ni, a fera e ni, a lot of people kwa a fera won, won ma, ki ki lo ki lo nje gbe yawo gan 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 won mo ta ba de wa won lesin keji wa gbogbo kini ina nse o ba ta wa mari o mo mo awon ore mi ton je pe lesin keji ni won je pe osu mefa la won fi se cancel it o fi lo ton bo ton sori sori se o wo gba ta wa la wa bo sile oko ko si nkan ko ton je marital cancel ko ja eko ti ye eko lati le eko ti ba be eko lati le I bet you to recall that I write. 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 Expert counselors at a one afar. So the next time you go to training, see one train at one afar, not at one other people. So we are interested in this marital counseling because our people are now actually to reduce divorce. That look for lane in it. That we are more discussing football. At the end of the day, kilo je we will come to our da money fair, money fair. Nam, me, although you know, I need to run the up, inshallah. In the case of Islam, view Islam, Lori DNA test. Because what is the reason? Any infidelity, Imam Kubaili, at what are you saying? Lori program, we are going to ask for to do what we need to do to see. I mean, Mobi, we call him Mobi, Jomi, Kujomi. Can you view Islam, Lori DNA? And Tabawo, Islam will call what we're not in the DNA. It's just a proof and evidence, paternity evidence. So, to hear you say, now, so traditionally in Hindu Islam, we're going to be in Koshe, like we're talonu or more, she and he left, and he's going be key away, oh, fair, I want to be where I'm going to be fair, 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 I'm going in some of you may fact in a few thousand you may find it i will be daddy what jack we are going to happen what it built all the old one much what you have your more nine months seven way doubt to see one here so only about one or say she traditionally like to work okay she or more he she filters to be daddy he she filters almost you may find it because what you may find another thing for our so kai was a place scientifically that proof, that evidence, Islam or why gays DNA test. But in Islam, Sonny, this has to do with paternity. And there must not be further doubt because Ara Woman Kassid Sharia, one of the objectives of Sharia is the protection of family. Yes. So doing a DNA test that the result is faulted. She mo pe oro paternity omo yen na ti na ti se nko pelu yen so it is Islam so nsin ni pe the person to ma se DNA test yen pe to ba je muslim so mo what is at stake so that in our situations so la won yan lo se DNA se pe lo mi lo gba eyin 
Lord disrupts results to pada gbe jade te ba de wo ton je paternity ninu islam o gbodo je oruko o gbodo fun omo to obi ni oruko e in to de affect wa lori adoption na ni yen pe omo te ba adopt is not your biological child that child must not bear your name that mm. child should continue to bear his father's name to ba mo oruko ba be oto ni yen but that child should not bear your name because that it means you are saying you are biologically the child's father. So Islam will talk about paternity, rara. So it's Islam work. That one scholar is in work careful about is for it to bring out the exact result and for the paternity of that child not to be disrupted. Okay, any color say because all these things are human. Okay, any color say you work for the loss of okay. Eh, obo yon fun won lowo ko fun won ni first result ta so pa mo ti o nse ti baba eni bayi ko gbo jade pe baba eni bayi ni ta won scholars in mean so pe eni to ba ma se dna yen ko je muslim doctor te pa mo what is at stake so that result to ba ma gbe jade a je true result o ni je pa mo ti o nse baba e na ma lo so pe baba eni bayi ni abi ki se baba eni bayi that's mm. the only place the islam fi wa weary ni pa dna but that it is a form of a genetical proof evidence but this child belongs to so so and so this child belongs to so so and so islam or no dc but to repay the family units must be protected the family units must be preserved so we have to be careful let's ensure the result is the true result so in Islam, Lord is in here, but DNA. But that as a proof, Islam does not negate doing DNA. But the result must be guided to ensure it is bringing out the true result because it has to do with the paternity of that child. Uh, am I law? Can Islam do so the genotype now? Question that any concern you will view Islam do the genotype. And share my way. Taban Sora Wokini, or my okay, Shani no Kuran, shall mention genotype, Shani no Kuran, shall mention DNA, share and not be sorrow Nick by Boba Wokini. Directly, I'm not believing my sorrow Nick by Boba Wokini. But there are things of today, there are things that are part of knowledge of today. So I want to call out in law, in a Kuran, no, not in my moon for judging. That's if you portray whatever evidence they are bringing out, don't pay me each to hard. With scholars doing their mental assertion to derive things from Quran and Sunnah to make judgment on issues of today. So all these things are going on collectively. So uh, when couples who share DNA, I feel more believe in so any genotype genotype DNA Latin more. Do you are does your blood agree? And Marello me to marry to equate to Balo you or you mama wale wale wale. Why? But yeah, uh, yeah, we were negative. So by only blood group O negative or A negative. Talk about positive. We have blood. We will agree. So genocide. We go and we can go. Talk about Islam. Rara. Those are things of today that Islam does not negate. Islam does not have anything against it. As long as it does not go against anything Quran and Sunnah says. As long as it does not disrupt the preservation of family it does not negate sharia all the objectives of sharia all these wordings all these things of today and uh, ivf uh, all those things islam is not against most of these things as long as those things do not negate quran and sunnah does not go against uh, public interest does not go against the Makassid of Sharia, the objectives of Sharia. As long as the family unit is protected and preserved, all these things, Islam will need to say against them. Now, Madam de la Roba Alemi, I'm a Randy, I'll be by now, dear, dear. Yawa, Akil Shola, Nan, is a jupiti, is a jupiti, near him by our Shili, Keba, Puma, sisters who are yet to marry ke pa fun won ni oro yanju ati wipe yo da ko je pe ori fe nikan la base 
marriage wale lori i love him asuri fe ni kan ni ni ka busy ke si ba fun awon sisters wa da yet to marry ki la won ko ti kan wo la ni se je bi sore tere na won ke kan ba advice won na ni alhamdulillah rabbil alamin um like you said that we have mentioned this earlier on so we can't really you know emphasize the all these things enough we will continue to um, lay emphasis on it because so i need from time to time so love is not the only thing that we we end to people in marriage so it goes beyond beyond love so we you know like being trustworthy being reliable you know um being prayerful you know knowing whom you want to marry you know having agreement having a plan of actions how many children you want to have you know stating your financial um difficulties your financial state you know having prenuptial agreement all those stuff they they go a long way for sustainability of a marriage so those are all, most of the things that you need to look into before saying i do and then the issue of marriage counseling before marriage is very very important so we need to look into that too um so we are shying away from it and we 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 are not you know uh not so much into it as the other people from the the other religion so it's something to really look into and i am glad that her mommy in the house mentioned that uh nasfat has a program now you know like a counseling program and that the imams are going for training on that it's a very good thing to really invest on so if i put to invest on this and that you, uh, our sisters are encouraged to go for this marriage counseling there and then they will know if whoever they are going into the marriage is the person that they're supposed to go into it with from the beginning or it's not the person you know before they go too too long into the relationship then they can you know have a rethink of what they want to do rather than getting married and now discovering some things that you cannot cope with and the end result will be uh divorce eventually so marriage counseling is very very critical it's very very important before going into marriage so i will advise our young your young men and women out there that are aspiring to go into marriage to look for where to go for marriage counseling to look for a way of knowing each other you know before they go into the marriage to table their do's and don'ts and see if they both agree before they go into it marriage is something that you know you don't want to go into for the sake of going into it you want to go into it you know that your own as if your whole life depends on it so you want to invest every part of you you want to invest your money you want to invest your energy you want to invest everything that you have and you need to make it su su successful so you don't want to invest all those things you know and then everything will go will be thrown out of the door in no in no time um so cancelling agreement being reliable loving each other is 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 key too and being attracted to whoever you want to marry to if you're not attract you know attracted to each other you can you can last you can i can't imagine two people living in a home without any sort of attraction so there will, there will be something you know um bringing you back to each other you know maybe in your consinle in your konwanle there must be something that you will remember you know at the beginning of your relationship that will keep you um make you to hold on to that relationship that you don't want to let go so the attraction is uh is important then authenticity authenticity you need to be you know factual with each other you don't have to hide anything from each other if it means going into your past you know telling your past to whoever you want to go into the relationship with so that at the end of the day when he or she gets to know of this thing about you it won't be uh, a shock or it won't be like an alien situation that oh my god she didn't tell me if i know maybe i wouldn't have gone into the marriage uh with her so don't don't hide anything 
play an open open um open card game so that nothing will be will be surprising to any part of the of the relationship um I may mean, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala um, help us out so it's it's crucial it's 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 a very very um difficult thing to to handle but with Allah on your side with your steadfastness with endurance with perseverance uh, with love uh, with attraction and all those things that we have mentioned in the past you can make it work Along the I mean, I mean, I I I Yawa Rajawa Unike Tama Fishilo to the any incomes, Sari send this. You want to see me do that way to bring by marriage that the Lubodo Jew called Koi. She done done it. Tama Fishilo. Okay. Um, Taba woke one Jew Koko, a Jew Koko. Taba woke. Different cultures, that's the Barawanon. The Arabian culture. Nikbe, the Baikotomba Dao Ruko, Omani, daughter of, son of, a Magua Fatima, Bintra, so, a Bint Mohammed. A Fatima, or more Mohammed, Lubin. Aha. A Marimi, or Mani Ibn, so, son of. But Saba mm. will culture the British, especially Rawatawa, Nigeria, Abi America, Tibobwe. Kila one low, one low Mr., one low Mrs., one low Miss. Well. Tebari Mrs., what is your way? In ten years, call me Uruko Baba. Toko a son name, Uruko Queen. Tebari Miss, what is your ten years, call a son name, Uruko Baba. Mm. Islamically, one obinio any anybody who got a jail look or anything on she look or babe. We go feel look or no miss she look or babe. So lost a jail more or milati. So if it's a controversy, it's in one year. They cook for what after married to the pay and jail look or cover. So the pay if for instance our Nigerians in sin. Our turn between British culture and Arabian culture. Arabian culture, Nikbe, Obi, Wama, Wama, so being the law called Billy, Babel, Uruko Babel, the Lumatelli, Wama, so evening, who talk on it, Uruko Babel, the Lumatelli. In this Lamu call Nikbe, and your board of Fioruko and Lomi, Shiruko Babel, and your board of Jeruko and Lomi, Yato Sioruko Babel. But Saba wo ba wa se lo leni pe Mrs. Iwe Mrs. Mrs. Onike Aziz. Mrs. Aziz nkonko. Mrs. to wa ni bi oruko yen. Ko so pe eni ti mo fi ti mo pe ni surname ni be pe baba mi. So that is the understanding. But if I say Miss, don't mi pe ni ti ma pe a surname ni be baba mi. So me using Mrs. exactly. So me using Mrs means that son name is my husband no. not my father and that does not make me say he's my father no so so the basic thing is that islam ni oruko ti o ba je oruko babe eyan eyo gbodo je as ba oruko babe eyan o na lo fa de bi pe omo te eyan ba adopt e gbodo fun loruko yin hmm now, as a hair, a son of mm -mm, a distorted biological um, kidney, even lion, I've been by turn on change your call. Salalal is a turn on change your call, and I'll be okay. I won't look at an be change. I won't look at all just pay it's human. Oh, that, yeah, 
ko de awon to de je ko je oruko baba won anabi o ko si bi o se sound good to abi to mo re o da anabi o change oruko baba won ai mo ya awon to je pe mo tin je oruko won san kin se arabian te gbe ngba ti islam o de na n to nje won na na nje bilal bilal o so mo arabian so anabi o ever change oruko to je oruko babe eyan tori pe islam so pe e gbodo fi e gbodo je oruko mi abi ke foruko mi ropo oruko baba yin oruko baba yin le gbodo ma je but the difference in culture pe you say mrs mrs means what you have written as your surname is your husband's name and prefixing your name with miss means what you have written as your surname is the name of your father so if you say mrs the only issue is awon eyan to ma nko ba oruko baba won ati oko won papo so many compound name eh uh -huh. so it becomes a problem pe to ba ni whatever to ba lo nje nsin se mejeji loruko babe ni so yen ni controversy wa so i believe there is no controversy in you prefixing your name with mrs and answering your husband's name as your son name that does not mean you are equating him to your husband your father's exactly. name still remains your father's name because of the way arabians do put their names daughter of yeah. muhammad fatima bint muhammad fatima daughter of muhammad ah alhamdulillah rabbil alamin eh ari pe adu justice the topic ina ki olorun fun wa se eh awon aya wa yi won ni de adu apupo olorun ba ni o si de ba yin lo le ba wa san yin lesson ko sin ti afe fun yin eh to ju yi pe ka so pe jazakumo allah khairan jamia olorun ba se dada fun yin gbogbo ni ti kan yin to mi ati kan yin ti omi o be la tori ya wa ke usola olorun ba se dada fun yin olorun ola nu e fi ti yin le e fi ngbo tolorun e san ti yan ri inu ki yan ma se tolorun olorun aba fun yin o ni re yin o ni su yin olorun bo olorun papa e ba ki awon da di wa nbe yen eh awon ni won se wa la pupo e ba ro dinrin ti ba jade ti mura dada to ndan dada oko na fi lokan bale ni ko nse yawo ni kan lo fi oko ni lokan bale oko na ma nfi yawo na lokan bale ngba mi eh tu ma se dada ba ki awon baba wa nbe eh ba ki won ki olorun ba se dada fun olorun ma je ki won dagba ya olorun go lo won te bi lomo olorun je ojo lo mo ate yin na ni bi se yin ta yin mo yin mo olorun o olorun ma daru fun yin eh olorun ma olorun ma je si gun olorun Allah ma je ku baye ma je kiyan ku ba yin Allahu akbar Allah be ak bismillah rahmanir rahim wa dua wa li zazja ma wa adaka rabbuka wa man qalla wala la akhiratu khairul laka min al ula wala sawfa yutika rabbuka fa tardu alam yajika yatima fa awa wajadaka dolan fa hada wajadaka ailan fa hadna fa amal yatima fa la takar wa man sa'ila fa la tanya wa aman bi ni'mati rabbika fa atis papa yawa unike a olorun ba se dada fun yin olorun ba ada yi pe ati ni pe situation nigeria o tun show mbi bayi na eh lata yen na e tun ba wa soro na lo na ni eh kagara ko lo njo ko lo njo ko lo njo bayi ba jayi bayi o ba jayi mo yawa shadia unike olorun ma je mo ni rawo ma je mu se o aye ri na aye ma yin o olorun la yin lowo aye olorun la yin lowo kunrin Olorun la yin lo obirin Olorun la yin lo wo osu Olorun la yin lo wa je o aye ri na aye ma yin o Olorun la yin lo aye e ko se ku ma ri be e ko se ku ma ri be e ko se ku ma ri be yo ma ri be na ni nitori pe awon baba wa na ni awon na ni ojo ma ri be e ohun ni won e la awon baba wa ona la na fi sa sogbe e olorun to si won ni si roja ni mu ni ro eh atupa won tan mole kari aye e atupa kan na la tun fi tan mole yi na ara an baba wa a sheik al mubajjal al imam eh abdul aziz unike ara ohun ti won na le yi na are na la na ta wa be tori product ti won na ni wa eh lati pa ti baba ti fa wa ka kiri ka ko wo university ni ni gba yen ni baba ti pon wa ka kiri eh eh ibe na la si ni awo si la si gbugbu esi la si gbugbu esi oto ni baba ti ma nbi yan ni tara oto ni baba ti ma fi gbugbu nkan bi yan eh be na ni baba wo ni ke se je 
bello mi ba mo le ni e won la ti so fun won yan won tin pon wa ti pe ti pe is more than 25 years ago kolon ba si dada fun won ori si training e ji di si gbogbo eni baba ti fun wa e latara be won ko ko sa dua fun baba na e ki anu olohun ko ma ba mi ni baba ni waju leyin ni tori eru won na to bi e o to bi gan o to bi gan olohun si ba won gbe olohun si ba won gbe olohun gbo olohun e baba lo dele pe bismillahir rahmanir rahim allahumma ya man la tafta bi alki samawati wal ard wal la tafta bi ajinati fi butum atiya alut bina fi kodo ika wa kodo rika lutfan lutfan Lutfan, Lutfan, Lutfan. Yali kubi kara mika ya arhamun rahimi. Allahumma unsurna bifudil kasulton ana. Wa alfika farata aada ana. Wa akina fi autodina wala awmurana hiyarana. Wa la tuwa umurana shirarana. Wa rufa masbaka wa barbaka ana. Wa la tuwa talina bisunubina la ya afuka wa la ya arhamna. Ya arubala halami. Olongu, uchua shiri baba walana. Tufi dini ti won fi di cm to fi di ti lu maka to ba di ola olorun ma tu asiri won e o ti fi mama wala na ima yana tun wa tun do ba e ima na do kari a o ti kari aye e o ti di international ima ima to ba ti di white house e ko ti bi ta tun be kun de mo o ti kari aye ni olorun baba wala olorun ma mi re ni won olorun gbogbo to wa jade lara won olorun ma pe ni ranu olorun olorun ola ni olorun olorun je ko baba wa pe laye jan pe laye ola ogo awa sadura fun ya wa oni ke eh orun ni e gbugba yin fi yin saso awon obirin fi yin saso awon okunrin kan tun fi yin saso na olohun o ma je wo ni lojiji ola ogo ola 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 alikun alaafia olohun ba se fun yin alikun yo na olohun ba se fun yin alikun riri olohun ba se fun yin alikun agbega olohun ba se fun ni gbogbo gba olohun ba se fun yin ola ogo olohun ola anu olohun eh awon eyan yere ma se le gbe kini kini elomi o si le se de yo a ma pe gan kini Ubeti ba shebe ina shani aka uwal habta ina shani aka uwal habta ina shani aka uwal habta ba Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim Allah bna shira la kusudra wa da ani anka usro Allah di anka wa dzarak warfa ani Allah kubikro fa ina maali yusir yusro ina maali yusir yusro fa isa farabta fanza wa ila rubika farga wala hawla wala quwwata illa billah alilati gbe te wa nwa ta ma fi lo oni aso fi pe ife lo lohun ni sana bi mi ife lo lohun ni sana bi mi to fi jogun aye fun pelu orun eja fi ife bara wa gbe o ife ni jama mi ilo le gbolon lalejo ilo le gbolon lalejo ke so ife ni jama mi ilo le gbolon lalejo a ma fi le ina se lo insha allah a ma fi yonde awon aya wa onike a ma fi yonde awon eh kolon jo ijo to wa tun pe won eh a tun ma ri won pe eh awala ni won awon na ni wa eh bu wa ta ba tun ma ri won pe eh ko ni ni won lara ola illa billah linas ya wa kushara illa la amami insha allah warfa anau makana aliya ani ba ko platform ki gan woni eshi eshi pupo eshi pupo jazakumullah khairan jaza allah ba shida da fun yin ola ola la hawla wa la quwwata illa billah linas be tengu wa program yi eshi e jo dile jo bi oku insha allah insha allah tori elomi e marriage won o ti won the verge of collapse bayi ile elomi gan ti ile lo ko an gbo a si buju si lo kan iyawo na gbo a buju si lo kan ko si nti o daju ka gbo mari ra wa kile wa ma dun ko ma to islam ka se se tori ti le yin o ba to re ba ni ko a lo si jihad abi ko wa se dawa o teni da yin lohun eh o da bi nti o ti jeun ni te wa ni ko sare se bo kun ni en fi ma fi betita ti le ba da eh community ada ti community ba da society ba da ti society ba da our nation at large will be at peace ki olorun jo kolorun ba dura wa ola subhana rabbika rabbal izzat a ma yonda ya ya wa mu yonda yin eh ya wa mu yonda yin eh mu yonda yin insha allah mu yonda yin jazakallahu khairan
Alon va chila da kwi, eh, ya wala ti na ibe anye. Eh, ya wala kwi shola ajo shi tu itani, eh, ki ni, eh, katu lo, eh, ki alon va chila da kwi yina. Mou yonde yina, eh, mou yonde yina. Alhamdulillah. Insha Allah, alon va chila da kwi yonde yina. Ba kana, awa ten wo wa, ta ajudu wa ni ale ni, awa lo ni kwe ma lo, insha Allah. Eh, ta ajudu wa ni ale ni, insha Allah, 12.30 Eastern Time, insha Allah. Eh, pa diwa. Luri abala yina ni lati ma shita haju. Baka na 12.30 Eastern time la ma bere ta haju. Insha Allah. Baka na 11.30 ni Central time. Pacific time ma ma gena yin tati. Ni Nigeria ta bati shunwa yo tati ji e pade wa. Papa akanshi adru atun wa gugwa ta wala ti Nigeria ta am fi wu da data ta fin wu 3 hours Two hours program wa yi. Ti o su su yin. Olo yi besi a yin. Olo ma ju o su yin la yi la yi. Olo u go. Olo ala o ma ro bana ya ro bana. Jak pa di la le fun ta hajud. La ti si kulu bana. Ba da izi. Ba kana ni jo sande. E pa di di deputy chief mission awa. Insha Allah. Ni jo sande. Ba ti mou tuma. Tuma be. E ni mwa on topics di afe shi. Insha Allah. Ba kana. E mou sa dua ya wa yi. E mou de ton se na ni. Insha Allah. Ni ale. Yawa Yalaja wa Sharif Adibo Wali Remembrance of their father Alaji wa Ibrahim Alabi Aru Wola Ashi ni sen hatun she Ni tahajud Kolo njo Baba na iwa gitan do juko Baba wa Ibrahim Alabi Aru Kola Iwa gitan do juko Lo njo da Inti mwa file lo ma jo baje Inti 